cleaning up the town, making repairs type RP, stuff like that. Um, consider, you know, you're doing your uh, medical roleplay, you're, you're cleaning up your characters, you're healing your characters, you consider this the same for the time. Of course, we're going to be doing a time skip after this anyway, so things will sort of just revert back. But um, if you see a hole in a building somewhere, or you see a pile of bones or something, you can just, you know, roleplay out, like, putting up some planks, or picking up the bones and putting them in a wheelbarrow, or something like that. So you're free to interact with anything that makes sense. If something says it's going to be fixed or repaired or something like that, the repair is always a sort of like a boards put up, nailed up or something like that. So just so that you know ahead of time, uh, if you want to role play that, so far. Mm. All right. Other than that, um, do remember that we do consensual death rolls here. So if your character character is injured right now it is up to you to choose if you want that for your character nobody's pressuring you into that and um is there anything else i'm missing except you we're gonna kill you <laughs> okay, i got something on hey. oh, so <laughs> the only thing i got is pretty much the away team people Yippee. so those on the away team uh, i know i talked to a few of you over the week and did some injury rolls so you guys are all set you know what you need to do um, but those I did not talk to, those who are in Ayla's bubble, there's a special effect on it so it's a thing. Usually this is a 10 minute bubble that works kind of like magical adrenaline. This was an empowered uh, DM event for this. So everyone has 30 minutes. After that, th and 30 minutes from the sound of the rooster crow. After that 30 minutes, it pretty much turns off like a light switch. So uh, <laughs> you might go from feeling great to I want to die. Play it as you will. <laughs> <laughs> mm. Hooray. All right. Anything else? No, I think we should give you the chance to get into where wherever yeah. you were last session. If uh, you're yep. uh, supporting cast, or you weren't here last session, but you would have been in the town somewhere, you can start basically wherever you want. Some of the places where people were, you know, quote unquote, hiding out was inside the town hall. That's the one in the center of town, the basement. So you can start there. If you're a mm. guard. Who, or the, uh, if, we if also you played like a skeleton hiding or something. in the guild hall. Hiding in the guild hall, you can be hiding in the, the guard basement um, or the basement of the clinic. All those are sort of the, the series that people were hiding out. Um, that's everything, right? So go take some time. We'll, get... we'll uh, uh, ring the bell and. Yeah. Do you want those who are getting teleported from the pylon to? To wait, like stay here. Is there gonna is there gonna be little scenes for the town folk people first, and then we teleport in, or do you just want everyone to pick where they're starting? No, we're gonna be starting kind of all at the all at the same okay. time. It's all sort of happening instantaneously. Yep. Um, mm -hmm. So we'll give you like about five mm -hmm. minutes here to get into your places. Then we'll hit the roosters, and we're good to go for session. If anybody needs anything or is confused, just stay here. But everyone else, you can go ahead and start getting into places. Get moving, kiddos. Have fun. You have what? Uh, <laughs> oh, oh, sorry. Can you confirm that my voice changer is working? It is. It is working. Can you confirm that my voice changer is working? Awesome. Yes, yours is. Also, got me all brother. <laughs> Oh, yeah, there we go, brother. Can you confirm that you uh, have tested your recording? And uh, your yes, I fixed. Yes, all of it's playing. All of it's going smoothly. Initially, I didn't actually have any like visuals for whatever. I didn't have any visuals for whatever reason. But I, I fixed it. I fixed it. So now it's recording both scenery, it's recording the audio for my game, and it's recording my voice with a proper voice mod on. So we should be good to go. Yep. Fantastic. Yes. Oh, yeah. Okay. Oh wait, I have to have big boy speed. There's the update. I don't get the update. That is a question. Oh yes. Get everyone to safety. I was in here. That's right. Okay, time to get on the floor. Oh, I got it. Here, Phoenix. Lay on the floor. Yippee! Yippee! Hi, Locust. Hi, Spoons. How are you? I'm good. I'm ready to drag you down a staircase. Let's fucking go. Shoot me in the face. Shoot me in the fucking face. Shoot me in the face. Do it. I Do can't. It. I can't. I'm in my social one. I'm in my social. Ah. I can't shoot anyone.
I'm in, I'm in my combat one, but only until you guys rip the armor off of me so I can swap to my social. Oh yeah, I forgot I was to know. carrying your ass. But then I walked away. <laughs> Carrie, Carrie's more of an overstatement. You were dragging oh, me yeah. by my fucking feet. <laughs> like, I don't... Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not strong. <laughs> I'm gonna be the weakest link right here. That's... I'm fucking excited. Not really, but you know. I'm a dex fighter, not a strength fighter. Like, he's that guy. Hell yeah. Filthy fucking dex builds. Dex build, ew. Come here, you little shit. Hey, oh, what? Hey, oh. Spoons, your cape, your cape. <laughs> We're not started yet, I can fuck with it a little. Also, I, I where's my fucking base station? <laughs> I got dizzy. What the fuck? Oh, Zap isn't here. Tear you, you up from the floor up. You cannot catch me. <laughs> That's where you do your little weird teleport thing and I just grab you by your fucking spine like they did in X-Men. Oh god. <laughs> Oh god. Do you remember that where he teleports and god. he just goes <laughs> He just has him by his fucking spine, it's so fucked up. I'm scared. <laughs> Protect me. Big uh, big I, I am me. I, I am <laughs> fucked up. I can't stand. <laughs> Dude's almost dead. Nah, bro. I Run. Like, you want you want me to protect you? Boy, Run. None of us are barely stand this boy is fucked up beyond the thing. None of us are barely uh barely can walk at this point. Must much less Fine. fight. I, Spoons, I'm you actually do be floating. My you You're do be the floating. exception. You're the rare exception. I have a gash on my shoulder, and I'm experiencing exhaustion, and I'm about to hit my major flaw. So close. I regenerated. It'll be fun. Spoons, lower yourself. You'll be floating. No, regenerator. I can't. I don't have place space mover. <sighs> I will now be tall. I will now be tall. <laughs> okay. I will now be tall. <sighs> Oh god. It's okay. This is fine. I am a wind if maid. I, again, I could just be making myself a an inch taller. Oh my god, Hardy. I've Are you going to like superpower your so strength far. of love in order to help carry Phoenix down a staircase? Alright, uh, first of all, what the I fuck? Second of all... But... <laughs> the power of this romance. <sighs> What's romance? Pumping all my healing into him. Oh. Oh dear. <laughs> that can cause cancer. <laughs> oh wait, I restarted my model of my blood. Why did nobody tell me I was no longer bloody? Mm. Oh, we You're bloody. bloody in this house. On a side note, I'm gonna be lost for the ages. Bye guys! Bye Chapo! One way passage. I fucking hate this. It's one way? It's oh brother. One way! <laughs> one way. Oh, wait, guys! I don't want to go in! <laughs> Man is about to not have a good time. No, it's one away. Uh, oh, there goes fucking Wolf Talia. Oh boy. Oh boy. They were a wolf when I last saw them, so it makes sense. Oh, brother. I am still somewhat under the influence of Lahani, so I need to add my fucking pupils. There we go. Yeah, oh, you're, no. you're, you're, you're still <laughs> up. You fucking. You come here, bitch! I'll rip your throat out! Ah, uh, too tired to do it right now, though. What is wrong with you? You're a mini-ass computer, bro. Oh dear, it seems I have fallen into a trap. I am now going to fucking scream about it. Sorry, life alert doesn't, doesn't exist, so you have fallen and you can't get up, and there's no one to pick you up. Well, we're here. We're here to help pick him up. <laughs> I think I can pick up one sheet of your armor. That's good enough. We can get him down a staircase. <laughs> yes, let me, let me drag me down the staircase so I can slam my head on each stair as we fucking go down. I fucking cry, dude. Uh, 
You know, most people would pay to be surrounded by powerful women. I don't know what you mean. No, see, the problem is, is that if I were Edmund, I'd be fucking pleased. But Phoenix is just like, I wish I was not on the fucking floor right now and helping everyone else and not being useless. You're not useless. <laughs> I am now. My fucking arm doesn't work. Put me back in, coach. Give me an adrenaline shot. Put me back in. Nah, boy. You see, you, you uh, see that bench? You on it needs to be warmed up. Good job, champ. <laughs> oh, I'm gonna fucking. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, what's there? What's there? You can't reach me. You can't reach me. Can't reach you. Oh, yeah. look at that. Look at that. <laughs> 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 oh. Top tier locust RP right now. Right, we're in character. We are. <laughs> <sighs> Where'd the other girl go? <sighs> oh, come on. Oh, careful with that. <sighs> you get back to safety. I'll die for Locus this as long as I can. <laughs> oh, you keep, you keep uh, Phoenix to safety. You think we can carry it? Are you strong by any chance? I know parents it can be deceiving, but we really need a little help. I'm weak as hell. Are you alright? Oh, I think all of us are. It's a pretty good Too much blood for your size. Yeah, speak. Yeah, my leg is actually fucking killing it. Hey, Coach, how are you doing? Are you able to pick up Phoenix by any chance? Oh, my leg hurts like hell, but <laughs> right, come on. <laughs> Try to pick it up by the. <laughs> You're not gonna make it. Come on, oh, come on. <laughs> Give me a hand, big guy. Come here. Come on, let's try again. Let's go. Oh. <laughs> oh, my goodness, what are they putting in your meals? <laughs> If we can get him up to his feet. <laughs> well, that's, I don't that's think so, too. Next to the wall. Okay. <laughs> go past, go past. Alright, do you know how to scoot your ass? I'm going to move you on the wall. I, I can make a sense. I'm bleeding. <laughs> okay. Our friend here is having a little bit of trouble now. Come on. Come on. I'm helping you, come on. <laughs> Hi, we're moving patients down into the secret tunnel. There's a tunnel somewhere. I can't stay here. Did you touch the statue right there? Hi. I need a little one. Come on, big guy. I need to get back out there. Just give me another potion. You need to be able to stand up on your own first. I can. I can move just. Is something the matter? Do you need? Do you I need, need a minute. More potions. I need. I need healing. Something. Oh goodness. Uh, I'm giving you healing. The healing trying is to. Uh, well, we were moving the healing I'm doing into literally the everything tunnel, I can. But if you <sighs> come on, do as you must. I just need to know. I have 30 minutes. Oh. I have 30 minutes until I'm unconscious. <sighs> well, well yes, no one. this is as good a place as any for now. Either that or in the medical here. station. Stay here, right. okay? We'll do both then. As pet physician, oh. we'll utilize there. Don't That's bring the tunnel. Good. Too much time. It should be safe. <laughs> Drops are off. I'm gonna be ready back and forth. Uh, in here. Oh, right. I'm to Medical's back happening in the medical room. This can beds open, I believe. Scoop. <laughs> if not, right. just you put people on the couches and such. I know. Oh, I'm sorry. Yes. One more time. Chris. I'll get the door for you. <laughs> you want to lead the way? If you need to leave, <laughs> I'll grab her. I can't move anyway. Do what you must.
Of the beds free. Okay. Use the beds for critical patients only. This one's pretty bad. Though I don't think it's critical. Right, just take a seat for now. I or do that. It's all right. Don't panic. Let them work on you. Have faith in their abilities. Help me get my armor off and bit by bit. The latches. Pull forward. The braces. What is that? And me the plates. And the braces. The wrist and the side. Remove. Remove the arm guard from my arm. The bracer. I can't move my left arm. Right, so 
<laughs> so this is this looks bad. <laughs> He's terribly injured. <laughs> I cannot enter for a magic unless he is excited, but I will at least first do what I can. Slow down, Phoenix. We will. We will take care of him. We will. Slow down. We first need to breathe. Slow down, Phoenix. Slow down, I'm holding steady. Yes. Close your eyes. Just focus. I'm breathing slowly. And then, this, and then, then the clasps. <laughs> Remove them. And then the clasps. We should be able to pull most of the pieces off. From the sides. Yeah, and crash around things that are bleeding more. Apologies, we need to stop the blood first. Do as you must. Could you carry someone? I need to need attention at some point. Well, <laughs> 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 Just Don't breathe. Do not tense yourself. Just breathe. Oh jeez, you need to relax your body. Do not force the blood where it should not go. No way, you're talking about my blood. I so, so much pain. So much pain. No. He is focusing on uh, doing life saving measures right now. So that means that you Try have defended this town well. <sighs> but now, too lost. Can you apply pressure here? Let's just find the other areas. Yes. 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 On here so it doesn't Thank you. Move. You're doing well. Not doing very well. Stay calm. Pain is temporary. Remember that. Pain is only temporary. It will end. It will only end. Yeah, you stay calm. When the fire subsides, or when the embers cool, all I see now are flames. Then focus on those flames, and instead of seeing the ones you see, See the ones in the hearth, awaiting you. The warmth of that fire, touching your friends, keeping them warm, keeping you warm. Focus on those flames. The hearth is indeed soothing. Form of respite. Just Allow yourself to listen to it. Calm your mind that. Gonna have to improvise. Last bed is a Eva. Where? All right. I know food does a lot for you. I brought some scraps I found from the cafeteria. They'll be on the bed. Come on, man. Let's go to most of the main area is bandaged. That should at least stop the bleeding. There are 
still bullets, the metal balls, in my skin, I can feel them. But the process of is considered okay, otherwise. Let's see if we can find them. Dig through, if you must. Considering mm. luckily mm. the first aid kits come with the tracers. If they're good, man. But sure, that there are no fragments. They must be intact. If pieces are left behind, they will get infected and reduce my chances of healing faster. I'm right. I'm right here. Of course. Hey, can you get me one. Sorry, I'm. Try to relax as best you can. The first one. What is happening with you? Why? Why? The mess. Stay calm. Fight through this pain and win. You know, I can't. Be victorious as you already have been. Where's your wish? I'm sorry to interrupt. We have some, so we have someone who's no longer breathing right now. Go, Shasta. I'll keep my hands here. Thank you. I do not. I wish I could. Thank you. Have you remained safe, Delilah? I have hidden the entire time. This pleases me. Are you okay, Phoenix? He needs the bullets pulled out of him. Still. And I am holding two of his wounds closed, currently. I have two left. One in my left pectoral muscle. The other in my collarbone. Alright. Uh, my hands uh, I can get that are quite skilled. If someone could hand me a pair of tweezers and hopefully hold his wounds closed, perhaps I could get at least one of them. Eva, do as she asks. How can I do that? I have very nimble fingers. You are gifted with the small digits for writing. Perhaps they can also be useful for reaching things and and cost spaces. However, whatever Perhaps. magical energy I will do my best for you, Phoenix. Mm. I wish for you to live a very long life. I also wish for a long life. There are many creatures I still need to slay, including my old masters. And may your hands be stained with their blood <laughs> in the future. In time. In time. I need you to hold your hands where mine are. <laughs> hold his wounds closed. <laughs> Alright. It's Stay still. To flinch. It wasn't pain. Amelia. And one. Two. Flame pressure. How do you feel about cauterization? Bring something to my mouth. 
I will heat it with my breath. I was thinking something much simpler. All right, here. I was thinking my flame. <laughs> Do it. Go ahead. One, two, three. I'm sorry. <laughs> At least my hand is very small. That seems to have done it. I'm gonna go for the second bullet in his collarbone. Alright. Stay still. You can do this. What is it, Mira? One. We have grave grave injured. I'm going to tell you when to take your hand away. If you have one, two, take your hand away. Take your hand away. It absolutely has to. If it is, please it. Go ahead. The flame is gone. The flame is gone. Your wounds are cauterized. Your wounds are cauterized. Any way. I'm sorry. If it, if it can help, help uh, prolong or stabilize and go ahead. Otherwise, so sure. try to find some so so healing potions and maybe try to administer. At the very least, as well. Yes. I will try to clean the burns. Stay here. Do not move. Your bleeding has stopped. As you wish. As you wish. As you wish. I'm gonna grab some water and clean out the burns so they do not get infected. Alright. She reaches and grabs your hand. I can't do a lot, Phoenix. We survived. We made it. No rest. No rest. rest. She alive. You will stay still. You will not move. She's alive. I don't know. Thank the high heavens She's and the great alive. flame. She's alive. All right. Get some time for some rest, and maybe, and hopefully, you can you can see her soon. All right. For now. Take it easy, friend. All right. As you wish, Lady Ashville. I'm gonna go check. I'm gonna check up the status of other things, and and uh, if there's any other th people that need to uh, rescue. It. She's still alive. Thank you, my lady. Just fine. Stay laying down. I'm taking care of you. You're fine. The medics will deal with the other ones. And you are cauterized. And now your wounds are cleaned. I'm sure I can find some bandages somewhere. <laughs> there is, there's no need, just clean the burns, my body will, my body will do the rest, as long as I rest, I can heal on my own. Then I will watch over you as you rest. There are others that may require your attention, Delilah. Would your services not be better suited helping the masses instead of me? In my experience, it's fine. 
Okay. Perhaps I am being a little selfish. At least until I, I know you are stable. <sighs> you favor me. Yes. Why? Yes, I do, you silly boy. Toxin. Everything is closed. I don't, I don't know. It's cauterized and cleaned. If what you say is true, you will survive and be healthy again. I don't know about antitoxin. I'll do the fair. Bones are closing. The, the pain is still present. Uh, I, my arm. I should be able to move it by now. I can't lift by my shoulder. There's too much pain. Still, I will try to. Uh, uh, let me look at this. This beat some reason. Uh, is there something? In it? A, a bullet, perhaps, that we missed? No. No bullet. I can't. There is no feeling. The only feeling is pain. That I can't. My elbow, I can move. I can twitch my fingers. But the arm itself, I cannot. I cannot. Stay calm. Stay calm. I have tales of great warriors who would survive through combat. Come back riddled with wounds, but would not die. And yet, they would lose control of a limb, or perhaps a great portion of their body. So they survive, they paid a heavy toll. It is possible that Phoenix is suffering from a very similar ailment. No. 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 Stay calm. No. Your health will I cannot lose control of myself! Phoenix. You have survived. In what way is that any loss? If my body is broken, I am useless. I have no purpose. I cannot fight. I cannot work. How am I supposed to live? Time. You have lost nothing. You are you. You understand. You can't rush everything. You will heal. Excuse me. Phoenix. Please. Listen to me. I'm different than you. You are more fierce on and off the battlefield than many of your foes. They could not fail you, as you said. Even now, they could not be able to. That does not make you useless, nor broken. You will not lose control. You will heal. You will focus. You will find a way. There is still hope. You are your own. You are your own person. The only person that can make you useless is yourself. You are free. I don't, say I don't have magic, but I can at least take it out. Okay. <laughs> I can help you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm about to be something that's called shock. My life. 
What? Suffering? The terrible oil. I have faltered through. Night has been as humiliating. Is this? <laughs> there is no shame in this. You have survived. You are victorious. You saved people. You protected people. In this, there is no shame. None whatsoever. You're giving me pain, Cody. You are as formidable as you always have been. You actually did it there. Nothing has changed. Wounded all over the place, and he has. It is an obstacle, and you will work over it. Past it. Okay. You are not so weak as to give up just from this. A fire burns in you, and you will not let it snuff out. Get some of these layers. This one doesn't show up. This one's crying. And. No, we're gonna have to get some of Oh, and technically he's bleeding. Yes. But he's, or he's not breathing, but he's still bleeding. I am so happy that you came back. I was a little annoying. You are not friends. I won't let you be foolish. The pulse. And the pulse goes cold. Well, I'm your giraffe roll. I will help you. Uh, an inspection? Yes. Yeah. I think it's down right there. I don't want to study later, but for now. What? Is it that you need? Uh, just show it down the front. We're gonna down the stairs. Here to ensure that my friend lives. I will live. He will already be remembered as a hero. But I want him to remember himself as just as much of one. That is what I am here for. Go. Basically, leave me. Alone open to where you can see I it. wish to be alone. I can see him still breathing. Uh, and his right shoulder, uh, actually his left shoulder, a uh, deep cut straight to the bone. Basically, it's almost like You were a proud and impressive warrior. I could not have defended this town. Even half as impressively as you. May your wounds heal into glorious scars. Let's wear. There's no one who is arresting yet. Even though I am not free to do as such. I can at least walk. You will be fine. The one that thinks I'm scared of leaving here. Apparently. Are you still up and going? Uh, a little bit. Still open the wound. Five minutes. Finish the packing here. There's a there's a few more people here who need uh, more minor care. Amaris is in right. terrible condition. Um, Julia's I've been going up, around just. just I've, I've, I've been going around mainly just uh, 
doing life-saving measures, um, dealing with massive bleeds and such, uh, but there's still uh, fractures, broken bones, um, burns, things like that need to be handled. Go on the left. The one in heal. The one on the ground. The one on the ground is unconscious, bleeding, black tagged. Fuck. Don't waste supplies on them. The one on the bed also still has some stuff they need. Fish. Next to the No shit. The pack that on this side. You get one more pack. Okay. Fuck. I can. Eliza. The couch is just outside. One place more comfortable for Chris. Not the couch. What are you doing? Well, you're not supposed to be done. No, unfortunately, I seem to be deviating from the rules. Well, that's not allowed. What happened to you? Oh, well, I've given her a What is your worst wound? Where's my worst wound? Well, it's the one in my. Right here, you hide, and it's glowing purple. She had poison, and it seems to be a gaping wound. Dagger right here. So I think it's good to double check. Okay. I have an offer, but I'm pretty sure you won't want it. Oh, well, I'm not exactly scared of death. Okay, so it better be a good offer. Uh, Mani is currently unconscious, so you can see her staring at it. The cauterization in this situation is not a good idea, I'm just saying. It doesn't work on me like it does on this. It will light me ablaze like a fire in the doing? There are burn marks and scars along his chest where some of the bullet holes and other major wounds were. They were cauterized by someone using fire magic. Most of his bleeding has stopped and he's slowly beginning to heal, but he still looks like shit. Alright. Well, sorry, they're not dying. I mean, keep moving. Are you a surgeon? How are you doing? Uh, there seem to be some big gashes on that. Oh, you want to extend my life by a few minutes, then you can work on the legs as well. Let's get you to the side. I have no doubts. The pain's coming from the center. I don't quite care what you do down there. I've had med training to try to suture gashes on me for over nine years. I can tell you right now that you're not a trainee. Not really. Sometimes you have to go under the radar. Stay away from Pate. Stay away from Pate for a They're going to lower your blood pressure, which might cause a bit more danger. Excuse me? Not even good enough to be a trainee. My assessment is that you're slightly above average, so congratulations. You will hand you two M bottles. Don't. Oh, the magic's fully worn off. Oh, right. Oh, the painkiller's doing nothing. That's delightful. I know pain is yeah, temporary. Yeah, you don't have to. I'll take a look at you. Yes, yeah, 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 preach to me. Does help. But I'm just making sure everyone's gonna walk away from here. You mean things to put potions in? 
Mm. Uh, so he's already above 180. is for pain is for in Azmeth, which is counterproductive. Fire, Everything else you see is just a lot of all the being and then break down for any empty Are you alive, lad? I am. I can tell you that you're doing better than all the people here. I am. Let me feel myself a bit. Incredible amounts of pain. They say I am doing better than the rest, as they are all dying. Well, at least you have. As an insult. And what did I just have? So so. I don't want to be. Well, at the very least, there doesn't. Money's awake, we need somebody. Do you have any empty potion bottles? Oh, no, 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 it's my arm. Oh, is that Ayla? Someone needs your help. I should have been angry. Hello, they've got me alive and I'm in immense pain. Uh, I, I can see that you're not looking <laughs> very like, good. There's blood flowing in your mouth right wound now. And no. Right here. Uh, and it needs to be uh, taken care of. I can't do it. Uh, uh, lay on her Someone to hack. Lay on her face. I should have been suffocated on her own. Turn on her face. Turn on her face. Turn on her face. Turn on her face. Yes, definitely. Come on, come on. Um, right now, Mars is down, and if I just help you, yeah. 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 nothing yeah. too specific. Um, what do you need? Does she need it? She's um, awake now. So, open up blood. around her stomach area, her intestines are not hanging out, but they were hanging out a moment ago. The life stabilized her. So, nasty head wound, a few broken bones. She's going to be peeling stuff away, cutting away fabric pieces. Uh, her entire arm. Ugh, and that's very ominous. Yeah? Mm. Gonna beat me just gonna beat me physically or beat me in a challenge? You're patting Phoenix down for any empty potion bottles that he might have? Uh, he's got two no, he's of them. Scared. He's got two of them on his belt, sorry. Empty no, potion bottles, yep. Two, got it. Okay. Has anyone given you pain I don't have any mana and I can't, oh, I can't help without uh, it. Yes, that however, it seems that what I am is not a great I have a healing potion. Pain all over my body. That's yeah. just more numbing than it is actually. <laughs> What you see is that it's going to glow a much more fierce purple, and you still have mana. If you can, uh, I've got that, very yes. low amounts, but yes. If you have mana, injured. this purple is going to make you feel cold like the egg. Face. We got bandages that we can just wrap okay. the wound. Okay. Yep. And, okay. uh, and you're going to see yeah, certain right. small gashes that are trivial turn black. Inside. The sutures that Make you sure. right. use, they don't, they're not undone, however, they're added to by a disgusting black viscous fluid. Like blood, but thick and thick. Oh, you saw it, so you're... She takes it out of your mouth. So she's gonna start blotting focus on the others. The wounds, so allowing this effect to kind of take place more needs to it seems like so much self-healing. You've healed? It's not really as much as like it's a different it's a little stranger. However, what you're looking at 
considering that's a touch isn't much. human in any way, shape, or form. Okay, okay. okay. And <laughs> sure, that's it. you can sure, sure you can do. Okay. It's just one of the most foreign things that you've seen. There's okay. arteries where they're not really really there's veins and vessels She's asleep. where you know you've healed before okay. on other humans that they're not exactly supposed to be. There should be a thought. And his body is reaction reacting to certain things differently <laughs> than a regular human body would. Uh, and the so did it seem to uh, get a little bit more uh, intense. Any, like bullets or did it seem like anything? it was trying to taint uh, my nana to help itself? Might so it's here. very hard to <laughs> surmise the point. Such a uh, thing. You've now gotten to it and anesthetic guide. But, um, maybe maybe one is, sort of in her life. Uh, it seems uh, like it's very healthy. I like this a lot. But not in a way that you wanted it to. So what you're saying is normal medical, magical medical, and all that stuff is is reacting poorly. I apologize. It's not reacting poorly. It's doing its job, just not in the image that you want. It's one of the lights. And it seems that with what's already been happening to Otto, such as his arm, his cheek, and since you've been around him for a while, you'd be able to surmise that you're making doing amazing affecting Otto considerably worse. Grip, use your hand to put pressure on the wound. So with medical, that's the, uh, you, if you... I can't give you all the answers. <laughs> well, I'm just curious because I have it magically. Yeah. It's, you know, it's, a, you know what? You're right. Normal medical. Fuck, I, I'm sorry, I'm, 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 I'm a little... You have a lot of information, you took a lot of rolls. Here, Sesta. I'm gonna bonk you. I thought you were using magic. I thought you were using magic. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> I was, that's why I was like, wait, Red. normal medical and how I Because I saw your eyes glowing. I completely think you're being Because that was my last. Okay. Everything done. All right. So, we're just going to put the Dell back here. Put the Dell back here. We're just going to keep talking about this. You see it. So, um, I asked a bit more. I did it. The wound is substantial. It is a gaping wound. Um, and it seems to be leading into something that's very horrible. Something very different. And I've already given you that whole spiel. And would you want to risk it? Because I'll give you some risk. I'll give you a little bit more on to that. So yeah. Well, I'm not attempting to do uh, any yeah, surgery. Sure I'm attempting to clean it. So you're just doing more surgery. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, it's gone. I, I pushed it. It's fine. Other mom knows the ways to remove my arm. Okay. I just said I was doing that. that. I'm going to have a stroke. Hello. What? Where does it end? Where does it end? What's happening? What do you want? Does it end at the shoulder? The elbow? Where does it end? It ends above the above the elbow. Don't fall down. Right before this end, I said, I'm going to start cutting away cloth that can be cut and removing armor that can Oh no, I feel, you're I can feel a bad bit too here and now I'll be okay. I might have yeah. to change this new set. Does this, 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 this shoulder look like it's in the pocket? Oh no, did it go through? Oh gosh, oh, yeah. it's yeah. 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 Right, if you're more comfortable on your own, you can probably see the team by the end So, and, uh... Oh, there it is. Okay. So, this is what we're going to be working with, trying to maintain as much as we can. Um, this is going to be wrapped, and also saline in this, and rinsing and cleaning away as much as we can. It's good to see that you're on a bed. And and tighten comfortable I would rather be on my feet <clears throat> helping the rest yes yes you would be but you need to rest too people are worried about you too they should not be anymore 
Excuse me? Okay. No, but they will be. If what Nero Even says, if, they be. if what Nero says is true, then I am of no more use to this town. Nero would never say such a thing. Where did you get such ideas in your head? My left arm will not function properly. If I cannot move my arm, as I told him, I cannot fight, I cannot work, I will be useless as a man. You will not be useless. Lead her to your own strengths, Phoenix. <laughs> Find strength in what you can do and make it stronger. The only thing I was good at was fighting and killing. You are good for much more than fighting and killing. Everyone is worth far more than fighting and killing. Even you, even me, and everyone else. Maybe when I was born. But that's not what I am no. now. Everyone has potential. No matter how old you are. No matter what you've done in the past. No matter what sort of things held you back. You can always become something else. And do something else. Something that you want. You are worth more than just something who kills and fights. You have more worth than you are a person. And if you want to change, you can change. I know nothing else. Then let's learn something else. Yes. I'd be a hypocrite if I didn't offer. But I'm still learning much the same. Say again? You will teach him so he does not feel so much pain. I will teach him so that he can understand that he has he has the ability to do far more than what he thinks that his limits are. Because those are self-imposed limits. Well, that's part of the process. You gotta learn along the way. You can't have all the answers instantly. You can't find everything instantly. This one. I started doing. I don't understand. I don't understand. This cough. It should have left me days ago. Why is it still persistent? I have healed from much more. Why does it linger? Well, if you don't know the answer, let's figure it out, okay? We'll talk to some of the healers. Dark is one of them. Okay. And then does the blood have any properties worth noting? Or is this one? Nice. Any empty potion bottles? Uh, I might have dropped mine in the graveyard if you want to find some. Not one out there right now. Fair enough. Um, I can just help.
Chill. How you doing? I'll check on you later, okay? I'm fine. I can still work, I can do things. I don't know what's happening. My chest? I'll kill you. <laughs> do not touch me. I am unclean. That's not true. I mean, you're a little bloody. You do not smell of tiefling. You do not smell of anything that I have encountered before. What are you? This one is they. They. Explain that. How is he doing? Come over here. Broken. Do I see a big dip in your head? Step away. Yeah. Let them talk. Come with me. What are you? What do you care? What answer your question? I am a lizard folk who was stolen at a young age and mutated into this. This is not my natural body. We are they. We come from the dark place. Trapped there. Now we are free. Demons. Pure demons. I do not know what these demons are. Anna believes us beings of darkness, but not. we are not. Scissors. We come from the dark place. Starve there, because there is no light. All the cloth off. But now we are free. And this is not our natural body either. Much different than humans. This answers your question. It does. So then, what does this mean? I what are you here for? What is your purpose? What is purpose? Your instincts. Your drive. What do you do? What are you? Survive. Hunt. Feed. Survive. What do you feed on? What do you eat? What is your food? Something like this with the water in the water. Eat an in the woods. For many suns and moons. I understand that magic is something that they used to be. I thought Jack gets an alcohol for you. 
survive. But now we are here. And there is food. Much food. More food than we need. It is shared freedom. What you can tell as you're doing this, and you, this is the I do not trust you. Not yet. Why? You are hunter. You wish to survive. You fight. You kill. Not anymore. I am no hunter, I am no killer, I am no beast that I once was. I am a useless pile of muscle and bone. You are now, but you once were. Then what makes this different? Do you have a sense of companionship? Do you know who friends and family are? I keep looking at myself. I keep looking at myself. I'm playing Thursday night. I'm just going to have to find no kind of it. This one knows these words, yes. The people of this town never needed to use those words. The people of this town are good people. They have taken me and many like us in. If you harm them, I will hunt you. Tyrion begs this one to fight to protect this town, and this one did. Sustained injury, protecting you. Did not have to. You could have run. Did not deserve it. But did not. No need to. I do not know what Perhaps we are a lot more light than I initially left. Yes. You are not the only one. There are others like you here, are there not? Where, where exactly is it not broken? My body yes. is on the back. I thought so. I'm on your back. Just, it's like fractured or shattered. It's gonna be bad. It's gonna be worse than that. It's a problem to the end. They are free, but they are few. Get a splint. Both are arguing. As we all are. There are not many of us left who are free. Still find a surgeon. Somebody to find me to this thing. Alright, time for part two. She operated without my consent, and now I'm damaged, and I would like to see her damages. This is also gonna hurt. Do I look like a liar? Bleeding out. Just gonna stop it. Why stay in this place, then? You were here before. When the attack on the wolf spirit, you were here. You followed. It's like when, let's say, how a normal person You go where the injured go. 
Get the other side. Help someone who might be trapped underneath. Here we go. Come on. Why? But in this case, he's doing surgery. It is a He's getting wrapped up here, quite literally. You find the suffering of others as a feast. No, specifically, there's still internal bleeding. Hey, hey, hey. I wish I could heal yes. people. Okay. Yes. 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 Won't use sustains this one. Yeah, they're my most difficult Gives this one power. Demons. Would be a waste. Oh, come on. You would. Yeah. Oh, I see. Sorry. I'm 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 sorry. i Go to waste. As long as it does not harm us, I suppose I cannot care. It has not hurt you since. Seven. You see the same thing. They only think we are in it. This one did not hurt you. Did not cause it. Have you received any? No. You give it freely. You will do that. And what happens when we stop feeding you? Wonderful. Thank you. When we stop hurting you? Uh, go give a few more to the other. You will not. Thank you. This one has seen this. Always. Always. Feelings. This has not stopped since this one arrived. And you feel it. The rage. The sorrow I possess. F you look over your injuries. Most of the open wounds have already been cauterized. Everything else is closing up slowly, but he still looks like complete shit. He's in a lot of pain, and there's something wrong with his left arm, but there's nothing you can do about it. Okay, so he looks normal, his left arm hurts. He's getting Pretty better, much. okay. Pretty much. Mm. So taking a closer look at the left arm, can she figure nope. out, can she see what's wrong with it, or? There's, nope. nothing, there's nothing significantly wrong physically on the outside, but it took a lot of it took a lot of damage on the outside and around the joints, especially the shoulder region, uh, to the point where it has caused a nerve damage, so he can no longer use it properly. Okay. So it sounds like it's not something that you'd be able to repair. Exactly. It's beyond repair. Yep, it's beyond repair. Okay. Permanent injury type shit. Mm, stable. Okay. Mm. Hello there. Mm. Um, so looking over the room, uh, is there anyone on death's door that would be capable? She, she's gonna use her major. So, get a feel of the room and see if you need medical attention first. 
That's true. Remind me of your major. Um, Sorry, talking on top of you, Luca. <laughs> you're, okay. you're totally fine. Um, I should honestly know this by heart, shouldn't I? I just forget how I worded it. Um, crap. Ow! My head! <laughs> Just trying to play your feelings. Can't feel! No. <laughs> Can't feel. <laughs> oh god, I just hit stop streaming. Mother... <laughs> oh no! <laughs> god, so, 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 no. I'm pulling up my drive and I, I've, got, I've got spoilers, so I don't want to... <laughs> Usually it's on the hot bar, but god damn it. Poor Sizzle. Poor stream. Um, okay. Uh, uh, exceptional identifying injuries and their severity in a situation where there are multiple injured individuals at a glance, she can tell if someone is in moral danger. Alright, let me go find. Oh, yeah. I was gonna say, because I'm definitely at a state where I'm slowly beginning to heal again since I have been resting. I'm still fucked up, but I'm not in any danger of dying. Okay, go. Okay. Are you gonna walk around the room, or is it just so you can see from here? She walked from the main door over to here. She checked a couple people. She already had a good glance of the entire room. I can walk around again if you want me to. Talia and Manny are particularly. I just need someone with uh, a bit more upper body strength uh, to help with uh, opening the ribcage here. She has a bunch of bullet wounds that she's hitting the center of that help bullet, so it's like, there's something, but not fully healed, and her ache is being somewhat, uh, somewhat treated, but, um, it was, uh, but she's also been walking around a lot. It's a very, it's a very, as well as being, um, several, uh, her son was losing some of the meat. I'm looking over all his scars. Basically, <laughs> all the injuries. Is the chest healed to I am lucky to have survived this. It's closed. <laughs> We finally detected that there could be sitting down once again. I have no choice. I cannot fight or work any longer. My left arm. For now. No. No. For the rest of my life, perhaps. Not everything requires two arms. And if you see that's the peak of your value, then mm, maybe he's going to take more time for you to evaluate your worth. The only value I have was my strength and my fortitude, and both of which are failing me. <laughs> they don't make you they just keep you from the deep dark beyond. It just prolongs it. Without it, I will rapidly descend. Mm. That's a choice you make, not your body. If you have that mentality, you won't last at the night. Perhaps. I'll see how you feel. Do you need water? That is a yes. Could shards in 
Or is he doing here? Eva! One of the enemies is inside! Why is he here? Try to shoot the Tyrion. I knock him out and throw him in the prison. Why is he not dead? Because it seems like they still need questions from him. I will tear his throat out. You'll get your time. I'll keep that as a motivator. If you live the night, maybe you'll get your chance. No. Phoenix. Have you received a healing potion to you? She's stable, it seems. All the healing I can so far. If there are others worse than me, draw your attention to no, them. No, it's a fresh batch. They just made it. They're actively making more potions. Please take it if you haven't. The only injury he has is on his sticky, and it's gonna take a long time to heal. So, uh, if you, you probably overheard the list of her injuries, just more than likely, right? But she has most of her plate armor off. Got it. <laughs> so, bruises, bunch of bullet wounds, and her really, really nasty fucking leg wound right here. <laughs> Phoenix, <laughs> trust me. Me and him, me and Tyrion spoke with him, and there's and there's nothing more that we want him to end his life. <laughs> However, open. He tosses the cup in the water. <laughs> However, <laughs> Phoenix, he'll get punished, but he'll he'll be he'll be punished accordingly. He's not going to be that far. I'm going to his wrists. I still await my punishment as well. Never may happen. I have faith in you. And as I said, I shan't let go. Whatever may be, we'll figure out a way. There is nothing left words. of me now. Oh. What do you mean? That, why do you say that? I cannot move my arm. There is too much pain. I have lost my strength in it. Is that really... Is that really enough to say that you are no longer your I have lost my strength. I'm not gonna be able to stand on this more than my... I, this is probably going to bot, bot me for the rest of my life. I probably... However, that doesn't mean you are... You have you're lost your use. You have all your importance. You are still strong. Though it may, you may, you may, your arm may not be as if it may not work as well. That doesn't mean you are less, Phoenix. Alright, you're gonna be sitting there all day, you're gonna get some fresh air. No, you're not gonna want to lay here all the time. <laughs> Be a good arm. There you go. One step at a time. 
We all, we all have the capability of getting stronger and, and overcoming our adversities. So can you get it? For now, let's let you get that on from us. And you'll be stronger and better. As you wish. It's gonna lay him down slowly. Let's move out. It's unfortunate because one of them's a medic, from what I understood. Missing medic. Should we go talk outside for a moment? Just go for a minute. Watch it open. It's fine. <sighs> the opening of the doors, you're both injured. I walk over there. You're not having to walk too far. Come on. Fucking headaches. Oof. <sighs> yeah, tough ones. Right, come on. Come look the other way if you need to. You better you look that way, or is which way it's better to look? <sighs> this is fine now. Oh, are you fine? This okay, direction. I'm gonna go over here then, just so oh. we're out of reach of people. Because I have a feeling this conversation is going to be quite uh, delicate, shall I say. Okay. Word gets around. The walls have ears. Is there something you wish to discuss with me? Because I want to be here for a while. You might as well ask now before I leave. The pair of you. I'm sure you've got questions as well. I will let Kaji oh, speak first. Exactly. What exactly happened that day? I don't know if that was a day. What exactly happened that day? Is that what you're asking? Okay. How do I put this? A mission of mine had gone wrong. And I was left with uh, life-threatening injuries. 
you were walking by. We made a deal. It was consensual. You made a deal that I would look after your family and you would help, well, help me out in an hour of need. And before you worry and panic, your family are doing fine. I went and checked. They got out of my room. They did. They are living. Mm hmm. They're fine. Wow. Oh my goodness. The, 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 you're, you're positive? It's all in my own eyes. Why do you think I was gone for so long? <laughs> they live, they breathe, I can't it. and they are living off the cold I send them. So. I kept my promise. Oh, wow. <coughs> Where are they? From what I can recall, they were talking about Yawn, the clay region. Stay in there for a little bit before returning if things get easier. See? Wow. Mm -hmm. Oh, goodness me. At least that should keep you I'm... happiness on this, uh, I call it, this day. Tragedy. A day indeed. I would say a tragedy, yes. I just didn't want to say it, you know, since I wasn't here and it's not really my place to be saying. We could have used your help in defending this place. Well, what can I do? I have two little dainty daggers and I was busy checking on her family. So apologies for that. But, you know. Obligation elsewhere. This town isn't my priority. I don't spend time here. Do I now? I understand. <laughs> wow. Does that at least satisfy your curiosity? And yours as well? Or do you have more questions because I'm standing right here? <laughs> I guess Jorn is now on the to visit uh, list. Um, on... Right, let's not get overwhelmed by that. Um, you... For that agreement that I apparently took, and I don't remember, was there mm. anything that I still, I am yet still to fulfill? As of court, no. You were there to help me in my time of need, and... And the thing is, you can't just take away a damperism. It's not that easy. You can't just, you know. You Unless you want to try and become a true vampire, you have to kill me in order to do that. Not a really good idea. Could be another way. I would have to look into it. But no one really often looks into that sort of thing. And why would you? It is a lengthy process. Is there any way for... Hmm? Repeat that? 
I said it is a lengthy process to cure damperism. Uh, yes. Well, yes, it is, isn't it? So, what can you do? Mm. Nothing much as of right now. I mean, look at this place. It's in shambles and you need to clear it up. So. But, hopefully with my news, that should at least motivate you a little bit longer to know that your family is safe and that you can live another day helping your friends out here. Yes, that... Oh, I still can't believe I more than merely weeks ago. It happens. Oh, I now, never do you have any questions be... for me? So you might mean go join such a day. Um... Not so much questions, as much as names, places. I want to know where some of your family lives, and where Huel and mm. Ivy War can be found. Okay, I need to point out, no idea where he is. He went under the radar. I actually had to go talk to some friends of mine, and apparently he's gone... So, he might not rear his ugly head for a while. With the news of Mara Loon and... Well... Not here exactly, but people who were involved in here. Again, word gets round. The walls have ears. So, he's decided to take a... Back step and has decided to go underground for a little bit. But I can send letters and try and figure out where he is so you can enact your revenge on him. As for my family and some of those, um, if I remember correctly, Carly might be in this region. Carly? Maybe. Carly, my little sister. Little brat, though. He, um, it's better than nothing, though, my dear. Indeed. It takes time to get this sort of thing, and to, you know, get their location and all that. I will look into it more. I'll be heading out of the city, well, the town, and going into the nearby cities to see if I can find her. And if I do find her, I will send you word. Is that agreeable? Then you can start your little rampage mm. on killing her and the rest of my family. It will suffice. Well, it's better than nothing, then, my dear. Indeed. Kaji, do you have any more questions? <clears throat> You seem to be itching for more. Are you still planning on going with your shop idea? Or more notably the blood thing? I'm happy to send blood here to you continuously, but sometimes it may take a little bit of a longer process. I will need somebody to take over the shop for me, however, as I won't be around. You know what? Do me a favour then, Kaji. Are you working with the gu with the guardsmen still? Aye. Okay, this can be a part-time job for you then. Do you mind running the store? That way you can get your little supply of what you need from yours truly. And I know that is in safe hands. For what you've done to, for me, I... Sure. Perfect. We're all in agreement then. <laughs> Phoenix. Help Kaji out if you could. I don't know what sort of status you're in right now with... Uh... 
guards and the town itself. But help Kaji out if you can. When you can. Don't overexert yourself. And also, could you tell, um... His name's slipping my head. What's his name? The farmer. Farm boy. Edmund? Edmund, Eddie, that's it. Yeah, let him know the same situation. He can help co-work the shop if needed. He was already going to be working there anyway. Oh. We're still paying him, by the way. Just letting you know. If blood is not uh, something you can obtain at the time because of late deliveries or something, go to him. Pay him some gold. All right, I'll keep that in mind. If you can, make sure. Monitor her, make sure she doesn't, you know, suck the life out of him. Of course. She was... She has already taken from me. I watched. Sorry, who? You, you, you cut you. out again. Oh, from you, okay. Right, I see. Then, very well. Things get dire, I'm sure you'll be fine. If things do get dire, send me a letter. One of the, one of my, uh, well, not my people, but one of the assassins will get it to me regardless. Okay? Will do. Okay? Indeed. That includes you, not just you, the pair of you. As you wish, and also, if Marnie also needs to send a letter to me, let do it know. for her. No, do it for her. I don't oh. need <laughs> more people. Well, I don't need people immediately going to every single assassin that's in the town or outside of the town to pass me a letter. I trust you two enough to do it. I will know it from you two. Is that okay? It will be fine. All right. Any more questions before I... If you find Hewlin before I do, send me word, and I will do the I same. I will send you a letter. Trust me, if I find him, he's a dead man. Unfortunately not to me, I'm... You've seen how my arm is. <clears throat> There's no way I'm killing him. I will send you a letter. I will let you know his exact last location, and how long ago it was. As of writing the letter. As soon as I get the letter, I will be on my way. I will prepare just in case. Keep that, sh well, keep your sword sharp and your shield heavy. I don't know. No. And your arm healed, preferably. <sighs> and your arm, yes, that is true. Your arm healed as well. Be a good idea. <sighs> now. Anything else? Or have no. we had our... Not for me. Then... <sighs> Nothing... A pleasure. Are you one for Thank hugs? You. I'm not one for hugs, but I'm willing to take one. Sure. Oh dear. A handshake. I know what it is. Mm hmm. You're not very. It's not very easy to give you a handshake, is it now? I suppose not. Again, if you need me, I'll be around. Okay? Hmm. Thank you so much for your help. Well, I won't be around, but I'm only a letter away. Good. I'll see you later.
Wow. My family is alive. <laughs> I am happy for you. Even though I cannot feel happiness. <laughs> right, I'll soak it in later. Oh my goodness. Oh, now my head's starting to hurt again. You can see there's a... It, it's been slightly patched up, but part of her is cut off, and there's a big wound on the side of her head. Mm. You were dealt a destructive blow. Oh. How are you faring? Sorry? I said you were just... you were... Dealt a destructive blow. How are you faring? I... My... Well... Funny you say that, I wasn't feeling it at all up until just now. Well, no, I... Okay, so I was... But then... I had the idea of... Taking someone's blood of the wounded, and then, because from what I know, it heals me slightly, to some extent, so I tried that, and I think it just worked me. But I just didn't feel anything? Uh, no, you are not. I'm just talking about my injuries. I understand. Are you okay? I... Well, I was saying how I was not feeling any of my injuries at all for the last 20 minutes. But now my head's starting to hurt again. And... Um, uh, I would recommend that. Is... Steven Shambles, so is my shoulder. I need to get this sorted. I presume your wounds are coming back to haunt you. Hopefully this headache won't haunt me as for too long. If you need defeat tonight, visit me. For life, I think I'm actually not hungry on that mm. front. That is good then. Nero? Phoenix. Mm. How are you holding up? I'm standing. That is an impressive feat, after what you went through, after what we all went through. Likewise, you were just as injured as I am, but you were still standing. My best. Unfortunately, sometimes our best is not enough. So I have come to learn. <sighs> and yet, I do not believe that this diminishes the effort and the value of the effort. In the end, this was still a victory. In this dead. moment, said, this was still a victory. 
Turn the Turn rabbit, the pillet, leafside still stands. Talk, it was so urgent. I did not I... interrupt. Stands. No, the, the, it was mm. no, nothing. Uh, as for me, I'm my head's starting to hurt. You can see there's a big wound here with part of her ear cut off. Have you been seen to or have the critically injured been taking up all of the next time? I. I'm still able to stand and walk and heal myself. I it's not terrible. Right. So don't let me Have you washed it out? You don't want an infection. Have your wounds been tended to as well, Miro? I did not do anything. Yes. I was <sighs> sit down. I was helping. You must sit. You <laughs> must <laughs> sit. Sit and I will right. wash it out. I was tended to. Right, give me At a least, second. if only superficially, but my wounds have always healed fast. My skin has I always been I still thick. have some of the medical equipment from inside the medical My scars room. have been short-lived. I worry not for my own health. In that we are the same I again. Perhaps have overexerted myself. It might burn a little. Yeah, you can Say notice again. that this was... I said, in that, we are also the same. It's, uh, looks like there's some object that went, I see. like, n inside, uh... And yet another way in which we are the same, I would... I don't know what the part between think. the ear and the eye is called, but there. I believe we both overexerted ourselves. Yes. That. If it was for this town, I would gladly give my life. I do not think I should do any medical on you other than cleaning your wounds so it does not get infected. You should be I'm proud that it does not have to. Feverish at all? Perhaps. Uh, yeah, there's definitely some. I do not know what I will do now. Uh, but you yeah, should there's definitely success. something going on. <laughs> My friend. Roll a two. need to get in. I think that you need to get back into medical. You will do your best. Immediately. As you always have. You running a is it that bad? In... This yes, much has not bad. changed. Um, this is worse than you thought it would be. It is as you have said, Mira. This we are proud of you it for. Gets worse. It is as you have said. Phoenix. Sometimes our best is never enough. Amori, Phoenix. She <sighs> must go to medical now. It was worse than she thought. I see. And she is getting a fever. There could already be an infection starting. She needs medicine. Come, Kaji. We need to head inside them. Hi. Hmm. I thought this broken leg was gonna be the worst of my problems. Even then, I got off. Oh my. Yeah. I'll get leadership when we are tilted forward will result in this. Oh, it's so bright in here. Oh, goodness. As always, it remains well lit. At the very least. Oh, that feels like it's going straight to my head. The more people hit them, the more just seem to ignore anything until eventually they just give up. Right, yes. Right. Yes. I need to get you back to the I was treated a long time ago. That's why I was running around. Okay. Some people I have reason to get treated before I go out. Yes. He's using the crotch right now. And legs are very bandaged. I don't know where she, she might <sighs> I would say that I have suffered worse, but I believe this tops it all, as they say. Those are questions for another. Your life. For now. Alive. What do you mean for now? I survived. more today. I survived this time. Who knows how much longer I have left? 
With a wounded arm, I am only at half strength. This is the least I can do. I heard that. Not really sure what I can say. Right now. There is not much you can say. Yes. From what I, from what I gather, it's not someone I knew. It's time to put up the sword. Live a more calm life. Integral. Thank you. Someone I have not met now. I don't know, that sounds more freeing to me than not living a life of violence. Violence was all I was good at. It was all I was known for. Without it, I don't know who I will be. Uh, the brunette. I know nothing more, I am sorry. Maybe it's time to learn. I could not see the body. Perhaps. She was... This is not a time to ask either, covered. sadly. Okay. I don't know. We've said multiple times about I'm sure we will learn. freedom, slavery, stuff like that. That was the perfect Tyrion. excuse. Tyrion was Just attending the... Live a life without anything to worry about except maybe tending your crops or something. I feel bad that I didn't try. Mm -hmm. I didn't know it was happening. I don't mean to ramble about it, it's just an idea. Don't worry. Is there, is a, is a troubling time. If I'm trampled by guards or not. Sorry, he's running around like he's looking for The one that died. Why? Was it? Excuse me, sir, are you looking for something? Someone looking for Jack. Perished. Did you? She told me she was in the medical bay. Apparently. But if she's not inside, then. Someone named Haley. I didn't talk to them much, but. They were one of the uh, people from the Thieves Guild that came back from the uh, Maryland trip. The original one they went on. Uh, just let me know when you, uh, yeah. when you hear the harbor bell ring, that's when we're if sending off right Haley. Okay. Sounds good. Thanks. Question, or if Money. you can help. We cannot save them all, it seems. But that's our job. It still hurts just the same. Hey, uh, Fern. Me. If you hear the harbor bell go off, that's when we're sending Haley off. Yeah, want to be there? Mm. Need find stick. Don't know where stick is. Hey. If you uh, hear the harbor bell go off, that's when we're sending off Haley at the dock. The town needs to be repaired. I will offer what I can. You need to rest. If I can walk, I can still do things. When I am finished. And I will lay down. Running around letting people know. Yeah, so stubborn. Thank you. Oh, as always. I guess I can't fucking talk. You can feel them. I'll help you out. I can't do much, but I have one arm. I will give what little left I have to this town. Even if it kills me. What do we do now? Your death is not required for this town. Your life is. You know this. Do not throw it. Do not throw it away so carelessly. Uh, come on, big guys. There's a, bu a bunch of uh, bonds over here. I'm afraid of my own magic. Above you, the roof cracks and creaks. The forge. I cannot keep it steady.
Phoenix. Perhaps, perhaps now may not be the time to discuss this, but... Perhaps the forge should be rebuilt. Of course, we should discuss it with Bing, but... Perhaps a... An elevated wooden structure is perhaps not the safest of places for forge. And given that most of the town must be reconstructed anyways, it seems as good an opportunity as any. Hmm. Allow me to at least clean it up first. To remove the parts and things from the inside. And I will speak with Bing if it is necessary. But this was his forge, this was... He must. This was his. Yeah. Delilah. I'm proud of you. For why? Surviving. As you have already stated. Yes. I'm so sorry that I've burned you. Unnecessary pain. If any of the doctors were available, I would not have done such. You did what you could to help. For that I am thankful. Thank you as well. Glad you were there with him. I would not imagine straying. Your Kaji is being, um, taken care of. They are in surgery. That is good I've to made hear. sure. <laughs> by very skilled doctors, Iffy and I believe Alastair, Alexander, I'm not sure. Hello. Uh, your Kaji will be fine. Good to see you're still alive, man. The action you partook you as well. when you placed your a of pieces, mouth onto my skin. Alive. What was that? Uh, that it was for good luck. Uh, we're putting it all in the apothecary for now. Hmm. I see. Is this a normal custom for you humans? Some would say so. I see. I will keep it in mind then. Mm. Can't go far. Can't do this. Mm. I will leave you to your meeting. We... Thank you for your assistance, Delilah. Of course. We should probably pay respects. She sacrificed her life for this. I feel like I can stand on my own things by this go time, after I left. I won't say no to you carrying me. Oh. The town you found. I believe the results speak for itself. <laughs> One loss. <laughs> a few scrapes and bruises everywhere. I see you're walking again. Oh, as walking as you can be with a bandaged yeah. stump mm -hmm. to you. Mission accomplished, though. At least I can probably breathe again with those bullets out. Yeah, you'll need something. Uh. You'll need something <sighs> that to fix that. You can't exactly be used with a stump right there. <clears throat> Take it out. So I Phoenix. Still got one good hand. What is this? And my wings still work. There's gonna be a couple of. They caught him. Probably, uh. Can be put on trial. A couple hours before I can put Caught them back together to knit them back. Rory. But be able to Where is he? Die by tonight. Where 
Where how much I want to is he? One second. Guard cells, but at this point we shouldn't do anything. Is he there now? Probably. He will get his punishment. Press the shot. We cannot act in that capacity. We cannot bait ourselves to that. You deny me this again. Phoenix, if there's someone who wants who wants to see him dead. He came from and enabled and helped have my city fall and burn. Trust me. When I had no restraint, I would have slew him on sight. We can't do things like that. There has to be a way of things otherwise. We be alone as of the standards. They have no standards. They are not men. They are insects who deserve nothing but torture regardless of who or what they were. They committed crimes against people as a whole. Caused more amounts of imaginable pain than anyone could ever understand. They forfeited the and lives they, of go. those in chains. Phoenix, will it make that us any better if we endured them to that? Yes, because we would be slaying the ones who have harmed others. We would be avenging them. At what cost? I am already the a The humanity beast. you lost so long ago. Let me do it then. Not like this. He will receive the punishment. Please. Phoenix. His justice will be sold. But you are not the only one with right to murder him. You are not the only one with claims for his throat. And so I here have a claim. And so I must let him fall into the hands of those who know not what it is like to live in chains. No. He falls not into the hands of any who do not understand. He falls rather into the hands of those who do. The hands of those who will hear the cries of his victims. Oh, yes, you should see it. That pattern is crumpled. And will know what his true punishment may be. Death. I'm picking that up. So soon. And his maze. Would be a disservice to those we have lost. That's 20. <laughs> and those he has pained. He's putting them over the and then... You should be made an example. Bring an end. But the proper way. Or he. To let him die alone in a room at the hands of only one who he has faulted? That is no death. That is a mercy. That is no punishment. That is a gift. If you think that I would kill him quickly, you are mistaken. I would make his life I do not hell. think you would kill him quickly. His life can be much more hell than only one man may bring. You know this as well as I. By what? Sitting in a cage? Hand on your arm? No. <laughs> I think I see where he's going. We'll get our recompense if... If what he... What, if I'm understanding correctly. With more people. Justice will be done. Of that... 
You have my promise. I want to see him suffer just as much as anyone. And I want to see him pay for his crumbs. There will be no more sacrifices for the people of Leafside. I am always being reconciled by you three. As if I am a lost child. Do as you wish, then. You are no child. <laughs> what do you want? Phoenix, have you ever watched a town fall? This way seems blocked. I never had the chance. I was always kept in cages, behind closed doors and bars. This was my first. This was the first time I have seen warfare. The first time I have witnessed a siege with my own eyes. This was not mine. Phoenix, I have lived many long years. As you have told me. What has happened here is far from rare. I do not mean to treat you as a child, and I hope you do not interpret my actions as such. When I reach out to you, I reach out to you as a friend. Something I regrettably have had quite few of. Likewise was that as well. In my, in my many years, Phoenix, I have seen much pain. Never up close like this, but from afar, I've seen towns burn. I've seen from a distance mothers running from burning homes, their children in tow, arrows in their backs. I've seen children run over by horses. I've seen lives ended far too early. When I console you, as you say, I hope you understand that it comes, it comes from a place of great pain and pride. Pain that I, pain and grief that I could not, did not assist further than I could have all those years ago. And pride in seeing you giving so much of yourself to do what I wish I had so long ago. You are a greater man and a greater warrior, a greater hero than you know yourself to be, a greater than you treat yourself. You all speak of me in such high regards. As if I have done great things, I don't understand. I'm none of those things. I have lived most of my life in captivity. Always fighting, always killing, attempting to survive. And now I'm supposed to be, as you say, a hero? No, I don't believe myself to be. Phoenix. Before you thought because others told you to, or for yourself, for your own survival, today you thought 
because you wanted to. To protect others. I fought because this place took me in. I owe it to you all. It is my obligation. So? Sure. Still, you chose to do it. But who has demanded this of you? Who? Tell me now, what master has demanded this obligation of you? Not verbally, but I the innocent lives of this town, of this place, they demand it. If I am not to protect them... Please. They did not demand Look it. Me, Look you at me, You offered it. You've done a lot to protect all these people. Believe me when I say that. You had all the chances. Even if we've given you everything, even if we accept you with open arms. If people, if people make the choice to run away and not want to engage with this, it's understandable. Do you think there won't people who looked at the entire situation of this fucking army coming and looked at it saying, Oh yeah, I want to absolutely fight against that. No one would have looked at you bad. No one would have looked at you badly if you decided to run away. But yet you chose to stay. Why do you think you do that? Do you think out of obligation? Or do you think you did that because you do it for yourself? Because you care about this place? I don't know. I don't. I don't know. I don't know anything. I don't understand. That's good. Phoenix. These are not things you don't have to know. that you just. These are not things that you can figure out in just a day. These are things that you figure out over time. My advice as a forge master, as well as someone who considers you a friend, you don't need to think so fast that you make a quick decision. Take your time, think, consider. And when you have that answer for yourself, you tell me, right? I have never had time to think. All decisions were based on my survival. You need any help with whatever you're trying to- I saw you were carrying <sighs> things around. Now it's time for you to think for yourself, lad. Only you know what you truly really really feel in your heart. Wonderful. Oh, that's like a smell. That's what I was smelling. I got it. I miss that smell. Oh, fuck. Is that what you say? Let's get you some Sonic. Right. One moment before we... You go ahead into the Phoenix. tavern before you just run away. We need to say goodbye to someone. Come. Um, you can see off the dead. I'll be right with you, love. That is the least I can do. Excuse me. Phoenix. Can it wait? Uh, I'm sure someone in the uh, medical bay is requesting you. Was it Tyrion? Uh, no, another one of the guards. Mm. Here, let's, let's see off the dead first. Let, let's see off the dead first. It shouldn't take long. I will go when it is finished. Very well. Thank you for informing me. I'm pretty sure these all like broke up at the end of the day, whatever. Your mother died, so. I know we've only known this for a short time, but you were clearly also part. Right. Which right? You're right, I'm yeah. Of trying to get Melody back and finishing off it. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone had their pay, their path, and I've seen what you can do. You're a skilled, a skilled sharpshooter. You're a skilled fighter. And to see you take your life on the line for the cause, I can give you nothing but my deepest respect from the bottom of my heart. Thank you for your service. And wherever you might be going, 
hope the path you travel is safe and secure. And hopefully in due time laid with a lot of friends joining you and smiles. Stay safe, Ailey. And thank you. <sighs> Fucking hell. Ah, shite. Can't believe this. Fuck. Uh, anyone else? To speak. <laughs> Not good at these sorts of things. Definitely good at these sorts of things. Take it slow. But you two came you here for me. some fighting chance. You, you helped us find where Alp was. for it. That's a debt that I can never repay. At the bottom of my heart, thank you. Go in and rest well. Any others? Haley, you are a woman after my own heart. Damn good thief. Damn good pirate before that. Ironic that you ran with the false pride. Considering that you should be extremely proud of yourself. You saved a lot of people, risking your life for us. We send you off today with your fire blazing bright, and colors hoisted high, and we lay you to Fiddler's Green. Till we meet again, friend. Who next? I know you hadn't been with the town for very long, but had it not been for your efforts, there's a significant chance that you might not have had anything, nearly any information at all about Oaks of Had it not been for your bravery, there's a chance that the events of yesterday could have gone a lot different. Each side will be in your debt. Bless you. And may it be known, I want to speak to Violet. In your honor, and in the honor of all those who have fought, I'm going to be doing what I can to declare today a day of remembrance for people like you. Thank you very much. Hi. A warrior's death deserves a warrior's passage Bing. to pay the ferry. May we meet again in the Watcher's Halls. Anyone else to come forth? Their person of my hands. Tiffany. 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 Each one of us could have had a choice of running away from this. We chose the other. We chose the other. 
Birds are due. This way, the guard should know what's back there. Thank you for carrying me. Well, they were about that waterfall. I'm feeling it. I may see you when you move out to my Any reminders? Just don't let the debris here harm you. I'm sorry I did not know you well, but I know at the end. You fought like a fiend possessed. You fought to defend your allies and the people back home. You stood against a great evil. And because of you, in no sm small part, people prevailed. And so I send you off with the obsidian's blessing. She watch over this fallen warrior. Thank you. Any more approaching? And I think it may be time for the loved one to speak. Thank you all for your kind words. We, this was war. we may not have been here for a long time. We came here to at least try to get something to work, and clearly it did, but with a price that is so heavy that I don't even know how to describe it. Haley was a pride thief, a proud thief, a very good mother, a great leader, a smart woman, a strong woman, and some of you have witnessed it. She she chose to take care of me, just like she chose to come here and help. That same care, that same pride, and that same strength. And I don't think there's any better send off for her than this. <laughs> Thank you all so much. Um, and all right. I shall, I shall say some closing words, and we shall send her off. Haley, as it was said by many of you, was a great help to all of us, a spectacular thief, and a spectacular mentor. Through her sacrifice, the town lives in no. We have survived an incredibly difficult time. And it is in no small part due to the valiant sacrifice of not only Autumn, but of her. 
As expert a thief she is, seems she has stolen the last of our misfortunes. And from her loss, leaf side can flourish into something that I'm sure she would be proud of. I speak the words in the divine tongue. Got away up Troy Akario. Let the spiral carry you. Shall see her off as a town and as a community that she has ensured continues to survive. That is all. Arabos? Yeah. If you wouldn't mind uh, getting the cinder started. I'll wait for the boat to clear her ship and the wreckage. In the meanwhile, if you have a firearm, load it. After I fire the cannon, we'll give a synchronized salute. Understood? Understood. We do take part in it, do we? <laughs> do you want me to? It is not my choice. Do you want to honor her? to smolder. The rope holding the bow slips off. Once it's released, the barrage will drift away. All right, be ready. Firing. Guns high. Ready? Fire. She belongs to the spirits now. Yeah. And that is why they were created in the first place.
the Apostle of Acts would have said, he died and he Be careful, mighty lizard. There's a small goat going insane. <laughs> if she speaks of talking food, do not believe her. Fine. Was it you who wanted to see me, Kaji? My appetite is becoming un... Oh. Too much. I understand. Alright. <sighs> you're sorry, you're... You'll be fine to do this. I will survive. Just this time, do not overindulge. <laughs> Thank you. Shop when I'm completely healed. <laughs> that woman sucking that lizard's blood. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't do that. I, I, I. That is a weird kink. That is, that is a weird kink. I, I'm just. That is a very weird <laughs> kink. I'm just gonna. Yeah, I'm fine. That is, that, is, that is a weird kink over there. That is, they're sucking. They're, oh. Oh, just. Don't stare at it. <coughs> they're doing something that probably should be kept for private stuff. Ah. Uh, I believe that is all I can offer. Why did you point it out? <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> Thank you. I like this wall a lot, actually. It's a wall that actually was. <laughs> I can heal it. Don't worry, it will heal on its own. You're lucky that you did not see what I saw right now. Um. Uh, lying. Do you need rest? Exactly. You're so. You know what? No, never mind. Fine. Yeah, you're right. Right. You're right. I'm growing tired. I think I do. Rest well, then. Oh, uh, I'm sorry. I may have. Uh, Thank you. Accidentally bled on it a little more. I didn't mean to. And it's okay. No, watch out. And your stuff. I. Uh... It's all wrapped Your stuff in is oh, dear. Oh, well, what's wrong it's... with my stuff? Patty. He got a lot of, of lashes of swords and then <laughs> almost broke, really. Okay, let's.
it's it's very I'm wrong. Repair it. Yeah. Or maybe not. Maybe maybe Are you taking this off? With it. Yes. This one. This one is fine. Thanks. All right. I'm still alive. Yes. yes please. Your eyes. Yeah, you can go to work. Like down I guess. Oh. Yep, uh, I'll repair it. Last eye. <sighs> Took a Thank bullet you. to it. I'm sorry about that. I really. Frap, no, really. It was just a. Pulp. I really need it. I, I think that if, if I can repair at a certain point, I, I tried to I tried to bury it. And if it if that sword went through, your stuff would have probably been broken completely. And I would have been broken completely too. I can also switch it out for a different side. There's a metal rod inside of it. Oh? Alright, so it is. Then. I am. I, uh, oh, I'm going to be very honest, uh, sir. I, I, I also want to put in a that, compartment. Uh, well, well, anyways, I'm not leading to it. Of course. Uh, Rest well. I'm glad I wouldn't have been uh, completely uh, dead if, if that was, uh, you know, if that uh, went through. Cause, oh, so much. How are you? I'm busy. I want to sleep. I, I, I want some. Where is some? Probably left the other in a new place. Let us in the air. Let us in. I am pretty sure you're alive. That's her. So, if he picks up anything unreasonable, tell you immediately. Got it. Starts working. I'm glad to see you're still alive. Don't worry. Uh, currently, my right yeah, arm is a bit out of commission. So, I am just. I'm burned. Resting. Covered bandages. I had a. Blade of mine kind of stuck into my shoulder here, so I'm still recovering a bit. We match. <laughs> we do match. I, I will need to get to here later. Still recovering a bit. Yeah. I'm scared. Okay, I'll the, get uh, that taken uh, care of a little bit that later. That doesn't hmm? sound healthy. I'm fine. Just. Uh, freezing's not gonna help, but it's kind of stuck with the skin. Yeah. There was an explosion. I'm was glad explosion? you're doing okay. I was, I was a little worried. <laughs> that was, that was the pile on what I was actually currently resting on while being almost that bleed to death. Mm -hmm. Sounds like things here got an unfold really quick after I left. What death? <sighs> Yes, but the town still stands, so... I'm glad. Be a pretty, uh... Pretty bad mark on any Tengu's honor to find out the town fell apart while they went off and did something stupid. Well, don't do something stupid next time and just fucking stay here. I had faith in you all. Thank you. Big guy. Hello. You, 
you doing okay? I'm alive. But I... Yeah. I'm injured. I don't know how much time I have left. I cannot move my arm properly. And if I cannot move my arm, I don't know how much use I will be of this place any longer. Why, why, why do you think you won't be of any use? I have nothing but my strength, though others say otherwise. I don't know, I, I, I think there's a lot of other qualities people, people can have or, or develop. As you begin to pull at the rubble, Perhaps. it all shifts at once, <sighs> and you see the brick begin to collapse. <sighs> well, that's not good. I could not defend this place. I fought so hard. I, I'm... A lot of us did, and it's, it's tough. I guess some people also see it as a chance to rebuild, but you know, a lot of a lot of memories can also kind of get buried. I don't know. Perhaps. It took me a really long time to find a, a use outside of uh, what I used to do. I, was, I wasn't always a farmer. Um, but, you know, with time I developed it and, you know, here I am now. I became a different kind of use than what I used to be, but... It takes a long time and kind of feel not so good about yourself the whole time. And it's tough, but you find a way to keep going and, you know, here you go. And find another place. It's kind of like uh, migrating almost, like moving out. You got to be able to pack the, pack the boxes yourself. Migrating. <sighs> Thank you for your words. And you are? I'm Wilbur. Phoenix. Nice to meet you, Phoenix. Hi. You, you fought really, really well that night, but I'm sure you'll find other ways to fight. I hope so. I do hope so. Take care. You as well, but thank you again for your words.
Where'd it go? What? Nails. I think she went to nails and hinges. Mad. I keep that in mind. <laughs> uh, those are the shit that always gets broken during sieges. Nails for the sake of putting fucking planks back on the building and hinges to make sure the doors actually do what they're supposed to do. Alright. Target started working. I. I believe in you. All good. What about you, Vince, your cousin? Well, part of my trust was... What's wrong? Nothing, I just... I know why I'm here. Like, a lot of things. <laughs> no. Something to do with Nails. <laughs> Looks like he's gonna try and attack. Leave her, Johnny, leave her. <laughs> All the oceans beg and thunder. Uh, something, file. something, I don't know, deliver it. You survive. Have them delivered to us if they can. Uh, unfortunately. <laughs> now I'm here to annoy you. Uh, I am honored. Mm. But your time is wasted. We should we need to make sure that you're Why? We can make something. I'm gonna go quickly ask. <sighs> it's a pain now. It is progressing further. Helps at all, Captain. I can tell you the what is? All I can't is your affliction. Aside from a it's not an affliction. What would you call it? A natural part of my life. What was done to me was unnatural, but has become my natural life. I do not consider it to be well, natural in my state. Am I correct to say that you've suffered great damage to your arm, considering that you're not using both arms? <sighs> this is something that bothers you greatly. Terribly so, yes. Well, you and I, if you'd spare a look my way, appear to be in the same boat. Ever hear of a one-arm assassin? <laughs> one-armed hunters or blacksmiths rarely ever exist as well. I have no more use for this place. By your judgment... Sure. But that is your dominant hand, correct? Yes, it is. Then in my opinion, 
He can still temper steel. It just requires better patience. He can still wield a sword. It just needs a little extra dexterity. Just because you've suffered great damage does not mean that you're out for the count, that you're useless. Not only that, but you're useful in other regard. You're useful to me because I like talking to you. And I like being in your presence. However, don't let it go to your head. <laughs> I would never dream of it. Either way. What I'm saying, even with one arm, you're more than useful. I have seen fishermen with one arm. I have seen tailors with one arm. Not only that, but am I wrong to say that you appear to have some form of manipulation? Very minimal. You can still... And with that, it can be trained. Damages like that aren't always permanent. They sometimes are, but I don't think with the scar and with the damage, I feel like with time you'll be able to use it again. Just not now, of course. I heard what you said about yourself in the ward. I feel like it would be wrong of me to say that... <sighs> that you're right. It's very wrong of me to say such a thing. You're useless by your standard, by your perception. I'll give you that. But by mine and everybody else's, you're still Phoenix. You're nothing different. And we'll still want you around for you to repair our armor. And look at you. Do you see what you're doing right now? You are uprooting piles, hundreds of pounds of ash and wood with just one arm. Do you think I can do that? I just lost my only ability to do so. I'm useless as can be right now. Hopefully it grows back considering what I am. And I know what you know. I know you know what I am. I do, yes. Yes. <sighs> so hopefully if this grows back... I hope that your arm will regain its manipulation and capability. But do not say that about yourself. Do not say that you're useless. Do not say that you're... Just don't. As you wish. Thank you. I'm not forcing you or anything like that. I'm just saying that's not right. For you. I have been told as such by many others. Your ways many of thinking others. confuse me. Many others. How many of those quote unquote others are here in Leafside? Eva. Tyrion. Eva told you that you're useless. Tyrion told you that you're useless. No. They have told me the same thing about not oh. being useless. It appears that I'm in agreement with them for once. How surprising. Indeed. Phoenix. When it comes to morality, you know I'm on the opposite side of them. If it's coming from all sides of morality, where I murder for money, and they protect people for the sake of protecting, and both sides are telling you that you still have your uses, that you're still more than just a tool or a blacksmith, that you're Phoenix. You're him. You're just Phoenix. And that's all I want you to be. I don't want you to be a blacksmith. I don't want you to be a fucking bloodthirsty murderer capable of cleaving something in two. I want you to be Phoenix, a friend. That's all I want from you. That night where we drank together and sung our shanties. One of the fun, most fun nights I've ever had. Because this is one of the first times I've ever let my guard down, truly. Where I passed out because I was a little too tipsy and you didn't drive a dagger into my heart. It's what told me that you have changed.
for the better as well. I would want nothing more than to be what you asked me to be. I don't know anything else. I've spent all my uh, life you're here. fighting and yeah. killing and... I don't... I don't know who I am. I don't know what I am. I don't know what I am supposed to become. Without He's gonna take the back of your head and he's gonna put it in his chest. Come here. You are more than just strength. And you've already proved it countless times. It's why people want to be around you. It's why you haven't been locked up again. It's why we did let you, let you out. It's because we realized that you were more than just a monster. You were even a monster in the first place. You are one of the most impressive people I've ever met. Because you've changed in such a small amount of time. Do you think I can do that? I don't know. It's taken me months. It's taken me so, such a long time for me to change. But you've been doing it in leaps, by, leaps and bounds. I was, it was wrong of me to say that... You couldn't change. I took everything at safe, face value from you. And I didn't look any deeper. And it's one of my regrets. One of, a true regret of mine. Because I was wrong. I was horrifically wrong. And watching you... Do your best to uproot rubble and ruin so that may people may use this once again. This is a lot about you. It is something that you have known before. Something that you've been forced to do. But now you're using it to make the lives of others better. I'm a another medical facility. This place could probably yield beautiful plants for the alchemist shop. It is because of your efforts, because of your kindness, that this will be a place that people will frolic again. Because I feel like that's something that you're realizing. There are so many other examples where you've protected people. You've fought for us. You fought for you fought for us in this mission in this whole idiotic escapade. You've had opportunity to leave so many times, but you chose to stay to help. <laughs> Look, Phoenix, I get that you're down on yourself. I get that you have a rot perception of yourself that you think that you're a monster and everything like that but you have proven to me time and time again that you're not besides who's going to sing the lower parts of the shanties I certainly can't if I do things for others because it is needed, and it is wanted. If I sacrifice myself for those who not always deserve it, but because I am stronger, but because I am available, if it is not obligation, then what is it? Like I said, it's kindness. You could leave right now. And nobody would blame you. You could stop doing everything and just take time to rest. 
and nobody would bat an eye. But right now, I believe it is your kindness that is truly in there. That is, that is compelling you to do this. That's what I think. I could be wrong. Who knows? But What the fuck? What? Wasn't expecting that. What happened? Then she happens. You know what? Fair enough. No, yeah. I expected it to happen from a rune of your own. No, I got it blown off by a giant's uh, crowned dog. Hard to explain. Mm -hmm. But either way. Yeah, I mean... Phoenix. Hold on, give me just a second. Mm. You have kindness in you. You don't have to do anything. And the fact that you continue to choose to do things for others... It might be instinct. It could be instinct. But are you sure that's not kindness? That you've wanted? That you want to do this for others? Does kindness not also imply that there is happiness and joy behind it? And if that is the case, no. then why do I still not feel happy? Kindness does not mean anything about happiness. I'll be at the Kind house apparently my house didn't burn down. When you want to, get me there. Oh. Where are you going? Where is she? Where, what? Oh, you'll be in... I'll be in my house that has not burned down apparently. When you want Congratulations. to get me there. What I'm saying, Phoenix, is that you're, you're a delight, and I love you, and I think you're a very cool and enjoyable person to be around, and I would like to do it an additional time, with more alcohol this time. How about it? Love? What... what is love? Hmm? What is love? <laughs> love is Doesn't perception. Shut up. Love is... Don't you fucking is <laughs> love is interpretation. Because love is not something that has a set definition, it's an emotion. in my opinion. It's an emotion. It's something that's different for everybody. Mm -hmm. Completely and utterly different for everybody. It could exactly. be... Romantic. It could be... In a Rom family way? Romantic. As, like, the parents. Wait, I can't really be in a romantic way, but... Those who come together to form child. Yes! The sex knowing! Yes! <laughs> Fortunately, I'm obligated to deny such a thing. Um, however... What? A moment, a moment, a moment. What is sex? <laughs> I did not hear this massive man just say this, did I? I don't understand. It is where two people oh love God. each other very, very much, and then they get together in a bedroom and they... Not typically in a bedroom. Spaghetti be all over the bed, I guess. That is, the, that is the worst way you could have possibly <laughs> described it to somebody who has no concept okay. of it. Okay, look. Right, listen. Okay. What? Do you want to go into detail? I don't have the time to really go into detail of what sex in is. In the hypothetical but... that sex does exist, sex is a gift that one is... <laughs> You've got to remember that some... oh different, different species do different things when it comes to sex. <laughs> sex <laughs> is a gift that's given to somebody that is special. In the context well... of two people. It is something that they will often do if they think of each other very special. Sometimes it's not romantic. Sometimes it's something completely different because it's a very complicated thing to ask. Am I can't quite I explain in depth. Special to you? Will you perform? Not yes, in that way. Unfortunately. Him. With no, me. you're very special to you. Are... No, I am not. <laughs> you I'm are a taken very man. special to him. I will explain this to you later. Unfortunately, <laughs> because I need to go. Run off after. Fuck. <laughs> it's it's true. Melody, a moment before you depart. Yes, I. If you wish to speak about this later, I will not. I will allow it. I am curious. I need to give her keys. Yeah. You. Hello. It's a shame to see you go. Ah. 
I hope you have a Bastard. safe, safe travels. I'm, I'm gonna you fuck on your face. Yeah? Why? Just ah, it's crust. Fucking yeah. arm. Yeah. Oh. It hurts. I don't ah. know if you've noticed. Okay, well... Yeah. Either way, Melody. It's been a pleasure. You were terrible with social cues. How the fuck did you get that from us? It's a pleasure. It's a pleasure. I hope to see you again someday. Tree you are leaving tonight, that is. Mm, Damn right. Me and I'm, I'm going with Mishka. She's the best goddamn thing that has ever happened to me. I, I'm going to do my best to do so. If I find out you've treated her wrong, I will come back here and I will beat your ass to death's door. I do not care what state I... I'm in. I will come and beat you. I wouldn't blame you. I shall be heading I'm going to go... Hang on. Spend... What? As I am leaving, I bestow a title to you. Otto the Sex Knower, yet denier. You should be honored for the title. Exactly. Honor. You may call yourself neither the Sex Denier nor the Sex Knower. Well, you, you, you be the Sex Knower. There you go. So, Go on. you choose to free me from this title. To give me the versatility to choose between. Yes. <laughs> so you free Just me from little... this curse. I, okay. I'm not freeing you from the curse. I'm freeing you from that specific curse. Now you have a new one on you. Because now you have to actually, you know... <laughs> I'm gonna miss you, Melody. Be in the middle. <laughs> You're one of the first I'm people that I came out of my shell to. You're one of the first people that I actually thought of a would be a friend of mine. I'm gonna miss you truly. Come here. I would... All right. Come here. <laughs> <I don't care. laughs> it's a little, it's a little odd, a little difficult. Never done it like this, but <laughs> don't you don't I can feel those noises at. <laughs> <laughs> you can feel it on my face. <laughs> Cow, that actually hurt. Well, oh, yeah, that's man. because you're. Yeah, you, I'm. In, I'm sensitive Get about going. the Get going, Flora's. I'm... Flora, the snooze too. Bye. <laughs> Another term I am familiar with: snooze snoo. <laughs> ask Flora and ask uh, also when you get a chance. I will do such. I called you over here. <sighs> To extend my apologies. I was tasked yeah. with keeping you safe on that mission when we went to locate him by both Bing and Erebos. And I failed miserably, causing this to you. No. Get up. <sighs> this is my own doing. I got to... <sighs> I got too... jumpy. Too agitated with the fact that he'd managed to do the... shit to us. I wanted him dead. I wanted him gone. And I jumped the gun. I went in blindly. And I nearly got people killed. This. And I keep telling people this could have all been avoided. And I not come here. Sure. There have been moments where I've been crucial part in something, but none of it was worth losing lives over it. So many people have had their homes and their livelihoods now taken from them. Somebody has died because of all of this. Oh. 
I don't think it would be fair to put that blame on yourself. But I understand why you would, because I would do the same as well. Do you know the worst thing about everything? What is that? He made me watch as you all sailed away on that boat in Maraloon. He made me watch, watch you all bleed out, knowing I couldn't do anything. Mocked. Every moment he had, he mocked. He made sure. You like us having a moment. Really. He mocked every moment he could get to belittle and to make me feel, well, useless. And, as I said to Flora, I know for a fact we will, even though I walk out of this place free from him, and free for the first time in 23 years, I'm not technically free at the same time. I bear the scars of what he has done, not just on my face, but on every part of my body. I don't know if you could see Phoenix. Hello. Hello. We're having, a, we're having a talk here. Could you find me uh, could oh. you help me find somebody? I need to make sure I can uh. talk to them before they go to bed. There's two people actually. Oh, yeah, I talked to Gail and Amaris. I have bad news for you. I can't see. Could you help could you get somebody uh, I'll ask help? around. Yeah, I'll ask around. Gail and Amaris, yeah? Gail and Amaris, please. Thank you. Alright. Uh, she's looking for Gail and Amaris. I could not see them. I don't know if... Well, I'm sure you've noticed the... The ones on my face. The burns. The scars. The whip lashings that I have on my legs and my arms and my back. Oh. I'm familiar All with them. Them by him. Yes. Yeah. These scars won't heal. They may heal physically, and I may just have scars here and there, but the mental side of things, that is something I will never get back. He made me watch you all suffer. He made me attack you guys. And I was powerless to do anything. Once again. I was... Put in a situation... That I couldn't do anything in. But, in a way I got the last laugh. I got to stab him. I got to kill him. I killed the monster that has been plaguing me. And... Do you want to know something that adds insult to injury about all of this? <clears throat> this right here. This necklace. I found out a while back when I went to go see my mum. She was affected by elk. She had the arc that I originally had, but it seems that we swapped. I see. She told me that she lost a necklace to him. Something that she had since she was a little girl. And the motherfucker had it on him this whole time. He had it in his corpse. I took it. I took my necklace back. But it still feels like a slap in the face, the fact he had it this whole time. 
he had something of my mother's and that is something I can, well, I haven't back, but still doesn't bring all my mentality back, I guess. It, I've now taken a lot more of a colder approach and things in life and all of that. So. Yeah. I... There is not much I can offer except my own apologies for the situation, not out of regret, but out of sympathy. I may not have gone through what you have gone through in the exact level, but I have experienced something very similar. I am healing, or at least I would like to believe that I am, but I am not doing it alone. I'm doing it with the help of others. Yes. Good. We don't need more, well, we don't need more, um, I guess. Problems plaguing those who have done good. And... Can I ask a favor? Anything. Please watch after... Bing... and Gale... Amaris... Flora and Otto. Your friends. Your family. At this point, my family. They were they've been more of a family than my parents were actually ever. They haven't kept me locked away in a cage for whole my whole life and they haven't you know. Bottle me away as if I'm a toy. They've let me embrace everything that I've done. Let me take on the mistakes. And let me try to fix them. So please. Make sure that they're okay. As you wish. I would like to ask for a favor in return for taking on this task. Go on. Heal. Just heal. Excuse me. Yeah. Apologies to interrupt. Melody, I don't believe we actually had the chance to meet in person, but I know quite a lot about you. My name is Yulena Mark. I'm a former guild leader from the Capital Branch. And I'm here on a favor from Wolfric to assist in town with political affairs and the like. Um, oh, I see. I just wanted to uh, come over because I was able to pull together from uh, favors from my network of contacts and allocate uh, payment to everyone. 15 gold each for the work on the mission and the defense of the town. And in your case, Melody, Bing has foregone his payment. He wanted to give you extra funds for the road. Please give them back to us. I figured that's how it would go, and I figured you were going to be stubborn as well. I still have to get my gold back from the Maraloon. No, I don't remember who actually had that. Phoenix, take your payment. Give it to her. Work well done. Consider my apology as well. I don't want your money. I want my gold back from Maraloon though, because I gave somebody my pouch. This can be a start. Got Fifty then. gold in there, man. Mm. <laughs> or give it to somebody else who needs it. Oh, I will, at the very least, give you the fifteen that you are allocated minimum. Okay. Yeah. 
And I will find out who to give the extra 30 to. I doubt Bing. Bing's going to accept it, and uh, he accept may come it running to you to, to argue about it. Armor, if it's possible. I will try my best to convince him. I do not trust that man. Want to say that any closer to them being like anywhere closer? You want to say that again? <laughs> he knows. I know you don't trust me. See. Okay. Well, I don't know who they are, so... Again. I will heal. I have somebody who I trust a lot alongside me. Me and Nishka are going to be travelling together. Travel well, then. And I know Nishka would look after me. And I will look after Nishka. We will, well, try and try and, well, send postcards and the sorts to you guys, wherever we are. I've been demanded by, like, three people already, so. <laughs> and don't overwork yourself. In the forge. He's too stubborn. For that goes me. for you too. The pair of you, I please. Find, um, does anyone know where an alchemist is, or anybody that has a mana pot? I will need it for. I cannot hear a word you're saying. I'm so sorry. You're very quiet. Um, I was asking if there's an alchemist nearby. Or if anyone could get me a mana potion, I will need one for tonight. I am unfamiliar as to where they are, but you may attempt to find Arvis. I believe he is mm. knowledgeable in that element. I don't know, but I do need to talk to people. I've kept you, I've spoken to her off and off. Amaris is there. Safe. Speak to her. You were looking for her. Yeah. Amaris and I see Gale over there, and I want to have one last talk with Bing hey, um, before I go to bed. Do what you can. Is there anything you would like me to tell the boy? He was worried about you as well. A small one. Very small. Tell him to stop by my house if he needs to talk. I'm sure you would want to have a quick talk. I will send him your way eventually. Or if I'm still if I'm still work, lurking around late into the night. Of course. He can come run over. But, yeah. I'm going to talk to Laris, I need to. So. Safe travels. Thank you. Of course. Yeah, I'm going to be busy collecting supplies with Nishka for the next couple of weeks, so. Yeah. Be safe, then. I will continue my work. We'll try. Please don't overwork yourself. I will do my best. Let's have a talk. People were lying about you. No, no, I am real. I'm very real. Unnecessary, sir. I don't think so. Holy no, shit, they so treat me. I am aware, as many people keep yeah. telling me, oh, the the crime reason fire I did it, but yeah, I believe I people it. should be paid for their work. Yeah, you know, uh, Especially if that work is putting their the lives in the line. Was crying, so it was... I hope you've been doing well, though. Hey. Look, listen. Hey, I'm very joking. Well, it's been funny. very, very busy with all of this. Hi, I'm sorry. Where are you? 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 Okay. I've been out of the open well, for over 100 years. Well, well when the now you're free. There you are. Oh, right. You're, you're, you're here, yeah. so you're here. Keanu. Garden up. In the new tree. I'm still alive, yes. Can I, 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 can I
middle tree? No, 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 I'm gonna go outside it. I'm not going to stretch my legs over the Did, uh, okay, well, What I provided you do you well. Well, okay. Let's get your energy up. Oh, we go, I go by Ori now. Exactly. I saw things. Nice. Yeah. Okay, nice to meet you. Oh, um, um, Lucif, I've been kind of working at this a little bit. Uh, would it be safe to say that after mm -hmm. like two more minutes that I can kind of clear it out of the way? Uh, there's a huge pile of logs kind of sitting there. Absolutely. Right. When you when you feel that you've managed to clear it, you could just click the button and there you go. Thank you, Lucif. I wanted to ask yeah, you about uh, that. You know. It's, uh... Mm -hmm. I describe it. I, be, I became <clears throat> hysterical. I saw visages. I saw dreams of something. Fires made of gold. Dripping viscous liquid from underneath. Everything I saw was on fire. He broke through. There's, there's a place, right? I see it in my dreams sometimes. And a chamber to the heart. And there, it's where the honey comes from, I guess. Breaking through is painful, but once you do it once, you can. Walk it. Navigating the chambers ain't easy, but you can navigate it. And you can see more of what you're supposed to be. I guess is how I describe it. Thanks. I wasn't more of what I am supposed to be. Towards the end. So everyone's life is a spiral. And it ends somewhere. But before it ends, you metamorphosize into what you're meant to be. Haley turned into him. A hero. But the past is so easy. The photos for everyone. The chambers at the heart guide you. Well, it's not. It took like 15 of us to do it. Then again, he did have like skeletons and cultists and bombs. You followed a trail. I'm gonna go see if my house is uh, and you, still. You can metamorphosize there was far beyond your end. You blast lasers out of their mouth. And, and you can become some, something more. You can live your life. Perfect and free. That's what I've been clawing towards. But oh. my heart and the chambers are the same. And I don't, I, it's harder for me to navigate than it seems to be for others. I've already forcefully changed once. It's not forcefully. Find your purpose yet? No, I have not. Oh well. It's not by force, it's by volition. It's the purest act of volition. To be given a purpose. Mm. Meaning, a feeling, a reason to be. One that is born from you, not for you. Will this make me be a better person? To make you the best. I see.
Pistachio. Takes out a little vial full of his own blood. Take it before you go to sleep tonight. Die. It's a higher dose. But you'll see the chambers fully. They'll take you where you want to go. You've crossed the first threshold. The first step is always the hardest. Now it's just a matter of learning. Technically, I'm not really the person to talk to for that. Now, excuse me. I should probably catch up with Eris before I lose her scent. Do as you wish. No. You survived as well, Erebos. Yeah, I did. You look kind of, kind of fucked up, and yet even after all the fighting, you're already cleaning up. I can still move, but I have lost movement and motion in my left arm. I can only feel pain in it. Uh, your left arm too. Well, I didn't lose movement, but I can't really... Lift anything with it. Okay. Well, maybe you should rest. Every mess is in your responsibility, and it doesn't need to be done right away. You have other people, and you have time. I don't. I. <sighs> Do you know what happens when a wounded creature can no longer depend on its limb? No. By the laws of nature, it dies. It cannot defend itself against predators. It cannot forge for food. It cannot outrun anything that is rolling against it. It becomes useless to the pack, and it gets left behind. <laughs> Listen, Phoenix, you can kick a whole lot of ass with one less arm. I mean, you're pretty fucking strong. And I'm sure you could do a lot with what you still have. But you could do a lot more if you rested. Nobody here's gonna leave you behind. This town has been through a lot. And there are a lot of people here who have been with it for long. I haven't seen this town leave anybody behind before. Melody was mind controlled, captured by Elk, a neck super strong necromancer. And I wasn't there to save her, but. I also failed you in that regard as well. She was well. a threat. Listen, it's fine. Elk was quite a bastard. And um, it took a lot of us to take him down, so. But what I'm saying is Melody 
mind controlled. A threat to the town, to the people trying to save her, and yet we still went. We still brought her back. Just because you have one less arm doesn't mean anybody here is going to leave you behind. Should I ever fall? Should I ever come into a time of need? Will you be there to help me? <sighs> yeah, I will. I see. I would do the same for you as well. Good. But I don't think I'll be the one needing protecting. Let us hope not. <sighs> well, I say that, but I got quite fucked up by Elk, so... Maybe I should stop being so full of myself for, uh, for a moment. Maybe it is you who ought to get rest, then. <laughs> oh, well. I guess there's no rest for the wicked, so... You are far from wicked. I have seen what wicked looks like. And you have too. You've experienced it. We yeah. both have. Yeah, but sometimes I think I've turned into something that isn't too far off from what they are. Then bring yourself back. Try. I'll try. <sighs> Do you wish for a good luck charm? <laughs> I, uh... I don't think it'd do anything for me. I don't think anything about me is lucky. Then again, I am alive. I would say that as a start. I... Yeah, well, I'll, I'll take a good luck charm. As you wish. I was taught this by Delilah. She said it is something you humans do to those who uh, need good luck charms themselves. I'm gonna grab the back of your head. He's gonna put a fucking kiss on your forehead. There. I know not All what right. it fully means in your That's tongue, it. or your kind, but she said that it does help. Yeah, usually that's something you usually- I- I wouldn't know. Hi. Hi. Greetings, Amelia. Bunch of us are going to the tavern if you guys want to join. I... The tavern? I am still attempting to clean up the mess. Come on, Phoenix, take a break. Take a break. It hasn't been a day since the attack. <clears throat> like me, you haven't even slept since since the day it started. 
Oh yeah, no. Haven't really thought about it. Well, then take a break. Yeah. Besides, half of us are uh, still need to recover. <laughs> still need to recover to where we can actually really work. Yeah, the tavern's giving uh, people that lost their homes a place to sleep. I think their basement or cellar or whatever. So you have time. I have yet to visit my homes. I don't even know if it has been lost. Oh dear. Oh. It did have like a, the whole like sword thing. <laughs> Considering it's on the mountain, I, I doubt it. It seemed a lot of the fire started in the town. Yeah, just pick a table. There's multiple over there. Okay, I'm just gonna go sit down. It's my natural style. Like all the other stabbings I got. You can sit down here. How many did you guys look for? What? I can't be happy about this thing. Hey, we need to fucking break. It needs to be uh, because then it can become solid again and then it can become both lightweight as well as hard as shit. Why do you ask? You want me through something? I think I found another. You don't do that. That is the You want what? There we go. I think I found a nugget of at least 10. I don't know how many of them are. Oh, boy. Where did Nick go? Might wanna. Oh, yeah, I saw her running. Oh, Stay awake, man. Correct. I can only cut I can't go to bed. I need to do. I have a brain injury. I can prepare everything to get the message. Brain injury. I will go to the doctor first. Oh, no, right now. I'll go to sleep later. Yeah. I have to stay away from now. When it comes to the crafting, the aspect of, you know, putting the little stick together, he's probably a little bit more educated on them from the night. I mean, I can make a stiff prosthetic. I mean, I can make a piece of food. Meets my heart. But it comes a little bit harder. It's a little bit harder than that. We'll see what the full moon is. Tyrion just over there, surrounded by women. Just he has a wife as well. I don't know jack shit about any sort of like fancy tango stuff with us. I need to work together with you on that one. Tell me about it. 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 Tell me about did you pay for this? It was given out. It seems like the tavern's just giving out drinks and food for free tonight. I see. Then I will not need to repay you. Yeah, I, I have enough money as it is. I'll just give it to somebody else at that point. I have no use for currency. It does not do me any good. I mean, I don't buy much either, so... Yeah, I should probably... Well, I need a new weapon. Oh no, I did confirm to give me some knives. I want something other than knives. Uh, I should give me lockpicks. I don't really need much money. I mean, I have so much, I could probably, probably could last me a few months. Maybe. You do not plan to use these lockpicks inside the town, do you? Not currently. Good. 
I did. I remember I tried to break an elk's house a long time ago before we all knew he was like bad. And my lockpick broke, so I decided to try again. I probably should have tried again. Dragon's Ale. One of the most potent things here. Meant specifically for folk like you who can handle it. If I drank that, I reckon I'd die. Dragon's Ale. Is this what you brought to my house the other night as well? No, that was actually something that I could stomach and also drink. That was actually something considerably smaller and less proof. That will kill me if I drink it. I think. Maybe I should drink it. No, no, no. If it will kill me. There's more potent than any potion I've ever had. Better taste. No call is that great. Pretty good about pain, babe. True, yes. That is quite potent, from what I understand. I was here when they found it. I see. <laughs> what is this? Smoke. Make pain go away, make happy. I grow myself. <laughs> Why does, how does it make you happy? I've seen people it smoke is tobacco before. Type of drug. <laughs> Not tobacco. I make self. I make it myself. Oh. Special strain oh. husband. I don't think I should take this right now. I don't think I should take this. I don't know if I'm brave enough to try to. <laughs> Would you like to have a seat, Ayla? I'm just trying to keep Sure, I'll pop a squat. This is just like the blunt. I've got three. She just had three blunts. She just gave me a second. I'm alone in my own You can handle that, I mean, I guess. Okay. Well, you did a good job protecting the, the town. Thank you. Of course. Thank you for defeating the man who did this to us. Yes, I. Well, we can save them for a special occasion. The others were and did most of the heavy lifting, so. They would have perished if not for your assistance. You saved my life as well. I basically, I had to immediately offer it to Ava. Yeah. Well, I think she would have gone to the like, I finished a bottle of Dragon's Ale. He finished the whole thing! The whole I have yet to feel anything. The dragon, the good stuff. It's the good stuff. I, I, I figured you'd you, you just need a bit. According to Otto, this is the most potent alcohol that they have. Needed to let you know. I love just I having pain. Yeah, I mean, sometimes you need a couple of them. Mm. Especially with you. I, 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 I wouldn't be surprised. I suppose. <laughs> I'll, I'll grab you another one. You heard. Is this what everybody does? You feeling toasty at all? 
Because I heard they were all killed in the library. Huh? There we go. What does that like, mean? Mean? It's it's it means a little tipsy. You want to put a toast on the musket? I don't know. I need more alcohol. That's besides the point. You mean like that's a little bit? Oh, thanks. Thank you. Let me pull up another one. So I don't remember much. But I remember is a giant. Yes. Apologies. Just. Thank you, man. I would like your input. There's something to think about now. It's completely different. I think you would like the best of us to get your testimony. There is, yes. In place of part of my skull now. Your hair. You cut it. I didn't ask. I didn't cut it. Unfortunately, it was burnt off from a beam. Some sort of laser. I had that one. Huh? I had that one. I finished this one. Oh, you finished it? Oh, fuck. Yeah, that's you what I'm saying. It? It's gone, yes. You didn't sip it? It is empty. You're rolling an eight right now. <laughs> fuck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're gonna have a anyway, skull. My feelings aside. Hold on, I need to eat sharp on something. So, I owe it to you to tell. I will be sad. I really like it. Do you have anything to say about it? Perhaps I spoke too soon. The fuzzy feeling is returning to my head. Does it feel kind of nice? I have a metal plate in my head. My body feels light, but my head feels heavy. Yes, no. absolutely. If they fucking do that, I'm going to start shooting. They can do that as long as it doesn't feel bad. Hello, everyone. Uh, and then, oh, I boy. just want to inform you that uh, Bing says if anyone's smoking in the tavern tonight ends up burning it down, he will slap them with his penal code. Speaking of which, understood. Do you have a light by chance? Apparently, Bing does. <laughs> I can use my breath, if you wish. Okay, we'll have to look into that. Okay, well. Do it. A little, little breath. Get a breath, okay? Oh, okay. And I'm not on fire. Amazing. And now stick this in your mouth and inhale it. I was given my I was given my own by Fern. This should be yours. I know, but you're gonna need two. You're gonna they're gonna need two. You're gonna need two, my friend. Come here. There we go. I'll take that one, but I'm not I'm not doing that again because you need to just burnt my face off. There we go. Right. Hold still. Hold still. There we go. There we go. I lit it off of yours. The trick that I learned in Suna. <laughs> Mitch, my lungs feel like they are on fire. <coughs> give it a couple seconds. Give it, give, it, give, it, give, it, give it a couple seconds. Give it a couple seconds. And then take another hit. And it will smooth, and it will become a little bit better. It will be much better. I used to have eight of these a day in Suna. <laughs> Is this a smart idea for me to do? If you believe it not to be, then do not drink that. I'm helping fight those throwaway empties because things aren't spawning. Who's done? <laughs> you may take the plate from which the sushi came from. I don't know if this one spawns. Oh, this one's empty, though, right? That's empty. This is empty. Okay. Okay. 
I'll be back in a little bit. See how this is See how everyone else is doing. Oh, I need that. I am going to probably chuck you like a spear. Like yes, but you want to go from the situation of one day with alcohol, so a noble yeah, family. Yeah, yeah. 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 the bad side of COVID is. Yeah, I'm gonna chuck him, not fucking crush him. Doesn't particularly matter. I'm only standing. Yeah, I see Drake. Hmm? Yeah, they had one time. I said I told you I don't trust. Well, I haven't even knew it's gonna hear me. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Have a crack. Have a crack. I mean, it's a science, but I've had to myself. Thank you, Tom. Come on. Oh, I actually enjoy this. Oh, this is my podcast. Oh, Swedish. Because of Gwen. Swedish. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too much. Yeah, too I feel bad for you guys. You have to feel that. Yeah. 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 She has fought a lot of people in the past and then like sleeps. She has like defeated a whole bar by herself. How are you feeling, all of us? No one, like, antagonizes us. Still pretty terrible. I apologize. I think I had blood in my lungs. I don't know. I need to go home. Coughing up a lot of blood. I've been coughing a lot as well. Yeah, just, just take the one that. <laughs> Interesting. Interesting plant. What is it? I'm not stepping on any more fucking It's it's a fucking blunt. I swear to fucking god. Another one. So it's this. I I'm not looking to collect. Like the collector. Okay. I'll take it just so you don't have to have it, I guess. Okay. Now you have to smoke it, and I'm not really looking to put anything in my lungs right now, because if I cough, I think I will die. Maybe. It could, it could be cough. a lot of things. Okay. Got it. How are you two? Don't let him cough. I will attempt to make him not cough. I don't I don't know how you're gonna accomplish that, but alright. Tell me not to die. So, just finish the roof to the blacksmith. I can't control it. I mean, I can make myself I cleared cough, but if I cough, some of you know, the like, rubble I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna... by the stone building in the center of town. I was about to start on the second, but they brought me. They brought me here. Apologies, I. Everything. What? I I drank dragon's ale and had one of those medicinal drugs. Stop! Lift yourself up, Erebus. Lift up. Everything on my ribs. Everything hurts. Oh. <laughs> 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 
Friday? <laughs> Thank the old home. I guess. Oh, oh, just do it. Don't cough. Uh, He's not dying. I don't know. Damn it. So we'll have to pick up the pieces of that camp. Maybe we can find more documents there. And Look into the, that She's holding two blunts. Um, Tell is concerned because you coughed and you said, I'm dying. Yes. Yeah. yeah, I just told her that I will let you know, let her know that I, I checked on you. <laughs> Great. Great. You did okay. You feel good? She gave, she gave me the thing Fern gave everybody. And I, I'm not, I don't, I'm not using them because Phoenix mm. coughed and if I cough I will probably die and then I cough uh, without I didn't, anyway. I, I did not cough, you, you, you coughed, you were the one coughing, not, not me. No, but you took, you smoked the thing and you coughed. I did. Well, it makes sense, that's a good choice not to smoke. Right now, because you are very messed up in your lungs and whatnot. Yeah, I don't know if I want to mix the blood and smoke in my lungs. And... Oh, no, it's a good out. choice. I also wouldn't drink too much, but I think you're already doing that. What? Did you know that's upside down? But it helps with the pain. I, I'm aware. It's good for, well, it, it's good for, you know, and... Right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll let you do that. I'll, okay. Very good. Who is that? I didn't say it. Who? What? 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 Where? What? What are we talking about? What? I haven't had anything to, to eat today. At least a little bit of crepe. I am on the and I'm also on the bill. Fuzzy. Fern's kind of... Fern, who? White hair. Large woman. Right, yeah. What about, what about, what about Fern? I think. I. She's built well. She's very strong, yes. She has good muscles. Perhaps she trains. Maybe. I saw briefly. Fern. Show us your muscles. I told you. Thank you. Wow. Just pick up easy. You are strong. I've seen you lift heavy things. Your strong mom carried a thing all the way from beach to guilt. Did you say thing? You carried. You carried thing. The fuck. 
impressive feet. He is heavier than I am. And that was while bleeding to death, so very weak already. Impressive. Didn't, didn't, didn't give you... I'm proud of you. You did very good. I got another good luck charm. Yeah, she did that. Yeah, she gave me. Yeah, yeah. And she got really close, and she did that to me too. I see. Uh, I wouldn't tell. Would it? <coughs> nice. It's a nice feeling. It feels nice. You no, you, the bottle. You have to twist it. You have to turn it around. There, now try. Did it work? I'm drunk. I'm not drunk. You're 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 drunk. You're fucking. I. You're. I'm Erebos. <laughs> no, no, you're Erebos. I'm. Yeah, and you. Phoenix. Okay. I'm Phoenix. Oh, she's back. You said. Everything feels very fuzz, fuzzy. Can't think. I tell you, I don't even think you're speaking. What? 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 Yeah, he needs he needs to fucking sleep. Where he next sleep? Oh. Home is uh, my house is. I uh, um, I don't. Phoenix uh, can sleep with friends tonight if want. What? Fern lives in the woods. She made very nice house. Uh, oh, hot woods. House. My house. Phoenix lives in wood? Phoenix lives in wood. I, I do. I do. My house is... I know where house is. On cliff. It's next to... The water, waterfall. It's before Fern House. Tell where that is. Yes, yes, that. So, uh, Phoenix, Phoenix knows where he lives now. Can lead you back. Can I sleep now? You can come with Erebus. Erebus, do you wish to sleep? Do you wish to sleep with Fern, Erebus? What? What? Phoenix want help to house? Not, not, not yet. Just a few minutes. Just, just a few minutes. I, I will, I will. I don't want to hit your hand though. Give mom, give mom. Oh. <laughs> How do you not notice? Listen to your mother, Erebos. No, no. Give me. Oh. Not very dangerous. Dangerous. Yeah, that's why I want it. Yeah, it's fun, bro. No. Did you get some water, Phoenix? Water. I, uh, um... Water. Water. 
not to out. mention infection. Okay, well, I only have one functional hand, so I think I might have to ask you to get ready. Yo, Yo, Oh. 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 You shut up. You, you fuck you. Fuck you. No. No, you fuck. I. You. No. no fuck you. Mm, fuck. No, you. Fuck. Fuck you. Fuck you. Fuck. Fuck. Fuck you. I don't want to sleep with you. Why not? Because I want to sleep with Fern. Not. Okay. What? He wants to sleep with Fern. He's sitting alone. What a weirdo. Why? Yeah, why do you sit alone? Who are you? Yeah, why are you fucking sitting alone? Who are you? What are you doing here? Depressed? No, I'm not. I'm not depressed. I just sat. He's like, Making my rounds, so making my sad. rounds. How are you doing, my fine compatriot? What? Com who is, who is compadre? Compadre. Oh, usually that means father or compatriot. Fern. He, you no. Want to what with Fern? He wants to sleep with Fern. No. What? Yeah. No. You want to sleep with Fern? No. No. I. I sleep. I sleep with myself. I. I sleep alone. You. You want to sleep with. With. With Fern. You sleep with her. You want to sleep with me? Yes. Wait. My house. My house can't. How many? There's too many in my house. How do we? My bed is not. Home. What? What are you fu- Excuse me! Oh, oh. What was that? Did someone fart? <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> you! Big guy! I- <laughs> I'm not drunk. I'm not drunk, but I- I wanted to say- I wanted to say thank you for saving my life. Cause like- Lean- Lean's on your head. <laughs> Why is he farting? <laughs> huh? Huh? I'm leaning on your head. Okay. I hope it's uh, no. the spirits are here. They're gonna, uh, they're gonna fuck me. Too many voices. Your name is Phoenix, isn't it? Yes. Uh, <laughs> for, uh, yeah, thank you for saving me. Uh, I'll thank uh, you better when I'm not in like this state. So like, I'll thank you better. Uh, pushes you. Uh, uh, I, she's. She's telling. She's telling me something. I need to. I need to. I. I stand. Uh, 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 <laughs> How do I do oh. it? Just we just met. We just met. We met wild. 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 What? No, I No, I'm fine. No. Safe travel is my final uh, uh, where, where are we going? I, what's happening? We don't get, we don't get. back here, Eva. You can't just do that. He's not so big. Jeez, it's so hard to fucking... Oh, oh, hang on, hang on this sec. Yeah. I'll, I'll be up there in a little bit, yeah. Dragon dead. Oh. <laughs> oh. 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 Oh.
bereut. He wants to fuck me. What? Come on. And take you guys home. I don't want him to Okay, uh, not right now then, yeah. Come on. I'm gonna kill them. Come on. Where are we going? Take Phoenix where, home where, in an airboat's bed. Where? What? Airboat's here. You're going to sleep with Fern. What? I'm what? Come on. Bedtime. <sighs> Need sleep away. Oh. Bad consumption. I don't even know. Uh, I think I'm in too much pain. To... I don't uh... Uh, where, where, where are we? We're going home. Mm. Are we leaving? Be careful, we're go up. Mm. I... <sighs> but... <sighs> I think that one was me. Careful, boxes. <sighs> oh my, you're too big. Stop. I'm not... You're too... You're too big. I'm not big. You fuck you. Fuck, fuck you. Airbus sit. Airbus fuck sit. Me. Why? No, I said I won't be able to get back up. Maybe later. We'll get back up. We'll get you back no, up and no bring no Phoenix in house. <sighs> I live, I live here. Yeah. This, this one here. This one. This one? This, this one's mine. Jack, I'm gonna and bring you, you in. Ugh. <sighs> Ugh. A lot smaller than I remember. Ugh. <sighs> Get in bed. Uh, I take lantern. Uh, I, I brought it. Go way. lay down. Uh, I'll put it back. Go uh, lay down. Uh, Good night. Good night. Uh, Rest well. Uh, okay. Rest well.
Bye-bye, darling. Bye. That's a pretty long bye. Like, you know? Don't mind me, I crashed, I'm going back in.
What the fuck? Oh, it's not good. <laughs> The raccoon. The, the raccoon. This fucking guy. This, this, this fucking. Look at this motherfucker right here. You see this, this motherfucker right here? Fucking this fucking guy. guy. I, this. I, 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 have a, I have a delivery for you from the glitch box. From, from the what? Oh. Okay. <laughs> Can I can I can I can I give her can I, can, I, can I give her something else? Can can I give her something back? Can I just like return? Yeah. Okay. Just for it. Yeah. <clears throat> okay, these are for you. <laughs> she's she's screaming. <laughs> All right, good. Glad she got the message. She went, huh. Is um. She went, huh. Is Oracle still in the instance? Because I want to try to talk to her as Edmund if I have the chance. She is! Good, okay. I must depart, my fellows. Do I have an out? My face. Oh, socialize. Our Let me know if Phoenix bro. is gonna drink the beer. Because then I have to send you a dreams. Yes, uh, he actually did not drink it. Um, He got drunk and then passed out when he got brought home. Okay, so no dream sequence. No dream sequence. Understood. Not there this is time. a month break, so to know if he'd drink it at any point during the month break, I guess. We could probably just do that, yeah, honestly. I'll let you know. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, okay. yeah, yeah, yeah. Give, give, my, give my gaping maw of a head a kiss. Um, Thank you. I kept kissing with the Appreciate. angels. <laughs> Why didn't you sleep with me? Why didn't you sleep with me? <laughs> Why not? My Why not? my Why bed is empty. <laughs> Bro, you take up yeah, the entire oh thing, probably, God, dude. Like, you could lay on top of me. Be a man. Oh come on. <laughs> Be a man. Figure it out. I gotta, I gotta go do shit. I was literally abducted and taken to Fern's.
I can't go through over there. Oh. Holy moly, look at that. Both of you are still alive. <laughs> you should head in. But give me a kiss before you go. Oh, come on, that's sweet. Ah. <laughs> Back off. What? I'm just it's it's, it's a nice around. it's a nice thing to see. It's, you know. Good night. Have a good night. To bed soon. Sleep well then, Flora. Even after losing an arm, even after changing, <clears throat> even after having half my fur face burnt off, he still loves me. That's more than I've ever had in my life. I'd be proud of it. Not many women would do something like that, especially not with a man like you. Oh no, not at all. <laughs> I'm joking. No, it's... <sighs> it's, uh... You have a raccoon well, it's not something attempting to eat your quite, pants. Yeah, I know, but I'm, I'm kind of crying right now, so I'm going to... Oh, jeez, big guy. Uh, it means a lot to me. Yeah, no, fuck off. But do you want I'm me not to, crying. Do you want me to leave you alone? Would you rather... No, it's... I'm happy. It's tears of happiness. <laughs> well, that's good then, isn't it? I... Well, yes, but... I've never, met, I've never known this luck. Know that feeling that is too good to be true. Yeah, well, I mean, hey, count yourself lucky then. Like I said, not many men get to bear witness to such, uh, such good things. I suppose. I mean, shit, sure, you must have lost well, an arm, been... and you got you got hurt, and you got, you know, in this massive travesty-filled adventure with a group of your friends that you trust highly in order to go and kill some inglorious bastard who terrorized this town for God knows how long. I love that movie. Hmm. But... You've got people here, and, well... Suffice to say, I envy you. You've got a woman that you love, who loves you back just as much. It's a surprise. <laughs> well, not much of a surprise when you're a decent <sighs> man. You're a good person, Otto. No. I have my doubts. I have killed <clears throat> thousands of people. I am one of the most notorious assassins and mercenaries or privateer, whatever you want to fucking call it, across the world. My name is known in inner circles, in every garment, everywhere. And yet here you are inside this town. Yes. Good night, love. I'll see you there. She invited me to stay with her, and she did previously didn't want to stay. Together, oh, no. Usually when they stay together, it would often lead to a breakup. But I am going to be going to uh, sleep with her tonight in her bed. Like, not sleep with her, sleep with her. Uh, <laughs> you know what is I mean. This, is I, this like, one of those things bed. that you and Melody used to talk about then? <laughs> no, 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 no sex will be had. It's something where I am sleeping next to her for the sake of sleeping next to her. It's, it's, it's good, it's good, it's whatever. Good, no, Bye. you've earned it. Wait a minute, wait a minute! Okay, bye. They're gone. You can't have that. Sorry. They're busy. Uh, look, that was a shirtless man. That is a shirtless man. Holy shit. Hi, that's me. Gail, is that you? Tits out. It is, yeah. Hot down. I don't own clothes anymore. No, clearly not. You look like shit. Friend, how are you? Jesus. Sorry, <laughs> Carpenter. What? Are you alright? No. Better question, was okay. Layla hitting on you? Wait, what? Is Layla hitting on me? No. Oh. Hmm. Okay. Just making sure. Doesn't it do you have do you still have do you have a do you have a stogie? Do you either of you have a stogie? I would like another. Oh what? No, I've What are you talking about? My... I've I've been I've been cleaning I up mean, the bond the bond shed area since the since the attack has lifted. Been doing my best to kind Oh, of... that's where you've been. I've been over there the whole day. Have a good night, you, too. you as well, Gail. Have a good night. I've been there. I've been I there just tried night. to wave with his hand and I fucking can't. You, you. 
risking your life what? to help what? look what? for Snowbell when she went missing, going on to this mission with the others. Bullshit. Stop I was, it. I was being paid. You, you did good things. And besides, listen. What's better, anyway, you know? To be born good and have all of these great things about you, or to earn them through your own hard work and keeping? I haven't earned shit. You've earned I've been paid every step of the way. You've and earned being paid is a one of the lot more. highest motivations for me. You have earned a lot more than I have. What? You did good. Thank you. Sincerely. Whatever. But... They're, they're looking at us. Weird. Yeah, that was a little strange. I wasn't looking. looking. Are we staring? Are we looking? Are we staring? Staring at those oh, two right there. <laughs> I, even, <laughs> I even said your fucking name. Dude, I said your name. I, I didn't, said your fucking name. I didn't, I, didn't hear you. I didn't hear you say my name. I'm sorry. I was too busy. I was too busy staring off in that I direction. I was staring and looking at the two I was, pretty people over there. Right there. The, you know, yes, yes. People, the one pretty the person pretty right over there. there. Yes, yes, yes. My dad and my friend over there. That's yes. Amazing, yeah. Of course, yes. Indeed. Look at them. Oh. I'm crashing at your wave, place, video. Wave, wave, wave! Oh, there you go. I'm not waving to my girlfriend. Okay. She was what? waving! She go waving. go sleep with her. You said you were going to go sleep next to her. Go go sleep. Go do something. No, I, no, 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 she... Go. I still have... I still... I still have... Shut up. <laughs> <laughs> I still... I still would never forgive you for oh, what Phoenix you did, find... by the way. What do you mean? What do you mean? What are you, what, what are you talking mean? about? When we did, quote unquote, snoo snoo, and you decided to crawl into the bed after the fact. Oh, you for, fucking creep. Oh, okay, for warm. good heavens. Okay, it was warm. Oh. I hate love. God, that was a brutal look, awakening. All, look, all I'm saying is... Look, all, all I'm saying is... It was kind of funny. <laughs> also, Phoenix is going to want want an explanation what snoo snooing is. Good luck. She's oh, just ran off. <laughs> you gotta explain it to him now. <laughs> I'm. She has. She's heading to bed because she's very tired. I need to go say goodnight to my friends as well. Hey there, Tiny. How you doing? I know. I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna. I'll probably have a small walk around before I. Uh, you mind if I join could, you? What the f fuck? Yeah, sure. Oh. Oh, I've been all, I've been alive on this earth long enough to oh. know certain things. I grab your ear. Ouch. Your body. Like, release me. Release. Ow. It's cr kind of crusty. What? Okay, it's crunchy. What? I, I don't Have care. It. I don't care. Look, yeah. give me give me your hand. Give me your hand. Give me your hand. What? What? what, what? <laughs> There's the crust off your ear. Fucking <laughs> 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 weird. Ah! Ah! <laughs> oh god, you fuck us under them. <laughs> Look. I gotta stop yelling. Both me and you can, we can, we can, you know, we can establish a, a, a friendship here. We're both very crusty right now, like. <laughs> oh, good heavens! Look at that. It's so me and, like, Oof, you both of you need some lotion. Oh yeah, no, it's it's all over my body. Oh, I can see that like, now. Hey, I'm just saying. I'm just. My fucking patriot. What? My rotten soldier. My rotten soldier. I did, I wasn't even a knight. <laughs> <Cool. laughs> rotten soldier. <laughs> you are my rotten soldier. That's an it's endearing. It means something, but I'm not going to. That get sounds like it. an insult to me. What do I you think? think no, it's not. Sounds like an insult. Oh, it sounds like also, an insult. Also, okay. tell oh. Bing at some point, I do want to try uh, just grab him and pull him to the side in a moment. Just before I go to bed. Because I want to say night to him. He's... He died. Bing's fucking Sorry. dead. Bone hurting juice in hand. Excuse me. Excuse oh, me. bone hurting juice. Oh, you're, you're doing this bit. Okay. Oh, boy. Okay, anyway. I think, I think you, sh you two should have a walk along the beach or wherever the hell. And you guys Dogs. should talk. Yes. Just talk. talk. Okay, I can do that. Be kind. Have a delightful time. What are you saying? I've been on this planet long <laughs> enough. I'm I'm heavily insinuating something. Please don't be stupid. Poke your eyes. Ah, ah! What the hell? Stop poking his eyes. I haven't I haven't poked your eyes. Oh, don't, I'm, I'm don't, almost poking. Don't, your eyes. don't 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 Otto, please. I'd don't rather poke his eyes. Otto, I need those. Please. I'll. Okay. That's it. I'll I'm talk to him. I'm jumping into your bed tonight. What? I'm talking, I'm talking to Otto. Talk, I'm, I'm gonna sleep with your girlfriend. I'm gonna sleep <laughs> with her first. <laughs> That's fantastic. Anyway, I'm heading no, back. I do. See you, Otto. <laughs> Get the fuck out of here. Please. Good night, Otto. Lucky bastard, that one. I'm gonna sleep with his girlfriend. That's hilarious. <laughs> you absolutely should do it. 
Flora will, considering that we... Considering the limited time we have together right now. Oh, wait. Um, what, what do you... What do you mean, limited time? You just got back. Did Phoenix really not tell you anything? I didn't get to see him. He... I never... He never came by. Nobody okay. came by over by the, uh... In a couple weeks' time, me and Nishka will be heading out. We'll be leaving the town. Oh, uh... Oh, right. Got it, yeah. Uh... I see. This is the first time in 23 years. I'm able to. I've been given a chance to go and explore an adventure without having somebody watching me constantly. Right, right. No, or I'm having not. my parents on my back. And I'm happy for you, truly. I, I am. So. Go, go inside, you fucking drunkard. Get in there. Come on now. Get her to bed. Get. That's fantastic. Get, 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 get her in bed. That is unhealthy. Yeah, indeed. I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Look. I'm I'm okay. Seriously, I'll I'll come talk to you later. Okay, I'm I I've got a I've got something. I'm sure? yeah right. yeah no I'm I'm okay. I'll seriously. But greetings, hello. Yeah, My name's Edmund. Nice once. to meet you. Wait, no, I haven't met Sorry, you once. I've met you multiple times. My name is Edmund. Uh, you could just call me Ed or bastard or whatever you see fit. I'm I need I'm Connor. Well, nice fine. to meet you, Edmund. Connor, Ed, Go to bed. Ed. I'll come talk to you later. How am I gonna talk to you later if I'm in bed? I'll figure it out. Don't worry. All right, just. That's a good question. No, that's, that's a good question. That's called breaking into the barracks. I'm not gonna. I got something I'm doing right now. Okay. I'm gonna sleep in, I'm gonna sleep in, in your barracks. farm. There gods, there gods! There's a drunk woman in front of your lawn. Please take care of her. Oh my I... God, Chris! We have to go oh. inside now. I'm sorry. I, I have to take my you in. in the tavern. I need to go back and get. It. Um. Well, this is uh, not much of a walk, but you know, I'll take it. I know, I'm sorry. No, no, I just no. Just wanted to sit here for a moment. It's okay. I didn't know how long you're gonna be, so. It's fine. I, I, I'm sorry. I, I, I'm happy for you. Truly, I am, and I, I'm, I'm so thankful that you're okay. That you came back alive, at the very least. Seeing you go off on that mission, and then after after we had that talk, and then not return was uh, well, that was that, that was scary. It was terrifying, actually. But took a while. But you know, you're you're ba you're back, so you're alive, and that's that's what matters. That's the main thing. You were my first friend. I'm always... I'm always gonna miss you in that regard, then. It's just... Well, at, at least it was nice to see you one last time before you left off. Thank you for everything, Melody. Seriously. And I'm sorry for any grievances I may have caused you. You don't have to apologize, it's me who should be apologizing. What for? You didn't do anything wrong. Not this was let a man manipulate me and lured me into a trap which then broke the trust of many people. How are you supposed to around me? I drove 
number of people away. Yes, I can say, oh, it was all because of him. But I'd be wrong in saying that because I did walk right into it. You could have seen the signs. After all the badgering my mother <clears throat> used to tell me and why she and why we had those rules in the house. I didn't heed them because I was so resentful for them. The rules for giving a shit. <sighs> and it led me straight into a trap. No, not one trap. Two traps. And I know they sent people to their actual deaths on the second trap. Are they... I don't know what they told you, but... The heartbreak... I felt... And any sort of hope I had was crushed when I stood and I watched, standing alongside him, I watched the boat sail away and my dying friends on that boat, knowing the outcome of what happened. My best friend lying in her, in her own pool of blood. I was... tormented by that for weeks. I... I can't imagine what you went through. And I'm sorry you had to go through it. But you would... How could you have known? A man who can manipulate minds like that, it's not something you can just... I knew the risks the second time going in, yet I still went in thinking we had an opening. Instead, it caused... heartbreaks. Me being taken over again. I was locked away for weeks. I'm surprised I'm not in a catatonic <clears throat> state from it all. You're a lot stronger than you look. A lot smarter, too. I think that was because... I think there was a reason why I... I held out on that little bit of hope. That tiny bit of hope. That people would be back for me. But as the weeks went by, that hope did dwindle a little. He would even mock it. He would mock the fact of... Why do you still cling to hope? They don't care. They would have been here by now. But every time... Every time... They let me walk around, chained to the teeth, of course, with, uh, I don't really know what fucking metal <clears throat> it was, some sort of metal, pink metal, surprisingly. When I'd walk down the hallways with the guards, and I'd walk past the window, I'd ask them to let me look outside for a moment. Or oh, tried to. I'd point and grunt and some of them were okay, some of them let me, but others did not. They just ushered me along back to the cage I went. But every time. Every time I looked out of that window, that hope came back. 
because I knew the stars were there. I knew it wasn't just some horrible nightmare. I knew my friends would come for me. <sighs> and they did. They came for you. They brought some of the best fighters and healers and magical casters that this town could muster, loaded them onto a boat, and they came and got you. They brought you back alive. The fervor this town had, the amount of people asking what we were going to do to get you back, if only you could see it. Bing. Bing was furious. He was... Oh, the anger that Melton held. You, you could have thought he would have bent the entire guildhouse in half. He was pissed. Rightfully so. They took his daughter. He wanted every man, woman, and child here in this town banding together to either fight and kill Elk and get you back or to defend this town in the... In the event that something happened, of course, within reason, we had to explain to him that not everybody could fight, and he got the idea soon after. But, suffice to say that there was loads of people here who did not give up on you, me included. I, I wanted to go. I wanted to go and help, but I knew that that was not a good idea. I'm no fighter. Not a very good one, anyway. If I went with, I would have just slowed everybody down, or I would have died in the process and made things worse. And I'm glad I didn't go. Because the fight that took place here... Well, I... I hid cowered away inside the, uh, the farmhouse, praying to the gods that nothing broke in. But every day that went by that I didn't get you back, or the town didn't get you back, it was another day that we just wanted to do something, we wanted to see you. We wanted to make sure everything was going to be okay. And we got our wish. It came with its sacrifices and lots of us got injured in the process, here and there. And you, you. We had someone die too. I heard. Yeah, I... I heard. People were talking about it. It was one of the people... in Maraloon. It was part of the Thieves' Guild. It was the one who actually... grabbed us and... pulled us aside and told us the situation. Brought her... brought us to her... mentor leader. Hmm, yeah. She was a good, good person. She didn't deserve to die, though. No one deserves it. No. No, of course not. So... Not fair. In her honor, and with you back now. We're going to do our best to ensure that that doesn't happen again. But... <clears throat> you... You're leaving. You're going to find your own life now. So, and, uh, on that... Whatever life is on that, to be honest with you, I don't really know. It's a life away from him. One you get to make choices from. It can be whatever you want. 
I don't have the mark anymore. No, you don't. And I don't have my parents to bug me about what I'm doing wrong or why I'm out here. <laughs> well, if you ask me, I think... I told them that I would... If you ask me, I think, I think Nishka would... I uh... told them... <laughs> Nishka would stop you from doing anything a little too serious. Or stop you from hurting yourself, so... But continue. Apologies. My... I promised my parents something when I went to the academy. There was a reason why I didn't stay in the deep depths with them. Because I wanted to go and stop him. The man who plagued my mother made her become what she is. The thing is, I know for a fact. I can... I can say that I've done my task, but... I haven't fully completed it, in a way. I want to find out a true way to fix her. She was plagued by... I don't know. Elk had something to do with it. He made a what I believe to be like a siren of some sorts. Mm. Somebody who lures fishermen into the sea. Right, yeah. You tell me the stories. Yeah. And because of that, She's never been the same. She's always been a monster, in a way. And unfortunately, that was passed on to me. The during times of... high-stress situations and... emotional ter turmoil. It happened. I would change and hurt people I cared for, so I want to try and find a cure for that at least. I think you a will. A way to not let it happen again. I don't know. Maybe. You won't know if unless you try, so. It is at this point. Yeah. I guess. Gonna miss the guild. Why I came here. They'll miss you too. Came here to join my friends. Came here to join my friends to be something in this world. To help people. Nishka was in the same boat. I came here with the academy, technically. My friends, Masa, Anna, Raz, Laura, mm. Gail. So many of us came here from the academy after it closed. We had no other reason to go back home. Some of us didn't have very good lives back home. Why would we want to go back to it? You want something this more. guild was the escape for us. Turns out that was a lie as well. <sighs> I don't... I don't think so. It may not have been exactly what you thought it was, but... It was a stepping stone of some kind, at the very least. I mean, it was.
made you into who you are, technically. You're no, I don't think it did. You're still always going to be Melody. That 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 part isn't going to change. It, you you're going to have to repeat that. Yes, said you're sorry, you are, sorry. That, you're popping in and out, <laughs> sort of thing. I said you. I said you're always still going to be Melody. I mean that that part of you is never going to change. You'll still always always be you. That's that's not something that yeah. just disappears. I don't think that the guild made me who I am today. It's people who I came with who have made me who I am today. Mm. My dad. Caval. Flora. Gale. It's the people, not the place. The, aff the affiliation. Yeah. I suppose that's right. Sounds correct. Yeah. It sounds correct. No. I guess I'm also just scared of taking the next steps. This is something I've never done before and I'm taking a massive leap into something I have no idea what I'm about to get into. Well, I'm scared is one term, sure, but I'd say you're courageous. <laughs> Terrified. Terrified. I've never... I don't... I've never had to worry about this. I've never had to worry about where I'm going next. Who will be the next people I see? Because I've always had someone there with me. Or someone there to guide me. And it's now just going to be me and Nishka on our own. Well... I mean, like I said, Nishta will be there, and, uh, you know, she's, yeah. she's pretty good. Yeah. I know, she is. She's a wonderful person. <sighs> that she is. One hell of a woman, that's for sure. Huh. <laughs> Yeah. Feels like I'm doing everybody a disservice, so if I stayed. I <laughs> beg to differ, but actually I feel the opposite. I think a lot of, well, to be honest, yeah, I feel, a, a lot of people would say the opposite, but I think that I think I'd be doing them a disservice, though, if I was to stay at the same time. How so? They want... Everybody wants, you know, the people who they're close to to get better, to be better for themselves. If I stayed here, I would tend to be holding myself back from those around me. The only way I can heal from all of this trauma from everything he's done to me. I get it. It's unfortunately not to stay in one place right now. To, well, keep moving and to help other people who may not be able to have that person, like, I, I've I've been so lucky to have so people support me. But there's people out there that don't have that. They won't get it. And because what we've done is essentially break them out of a contract, 
they have no one by their side ever. It's only, it's only wise for me to help them in some way. I'd like to hope I'm helping them out in some way. There's not much else I can really say or talk about then, is there? I mean, you've made your choice. All you have to do now is Trust follow me, it. a few people have been trying to egg me to to stay and all that, so I, I couldn't do that. I know. I, I couldn't. I bet you I can tell you have like at least something a merry. Good night, friends. Good night, Talia. Go pass out on the floor. Good night, Talia. Travels. I can tell you we're just looking right now. A memory from this area. Right there. Erebos. And one of the of insanity. Me and Wolfric had to hold him down in order to make sure he was like, not going to hurt himself or others. <laughs> the talk with me and Ginny over there by the fountain. Talking about the plans of what to do about Elk. Buying my first Sooner tea in God knows how many years at the cafe, the bakery and cafe. Making this gun blade at the forge. Sildon cheering me on. <laughs> Sildon cheers everybody on. He's nice like that. I miss him. I do too. I miss a lot. Of, I'm going to miss a lot of people. We'll, uh, we'll be here, for the most part. I know I will be. I've, uh, <laughs> I've got nowhere else left to go, so this is, um, at the very least, this is my last stop, so. But people like Otto, Flora, I, I, I'd put some wages down that they'll stay here as well. So you always have some people, at the very yeah. least. I've asked other people to do the same, to do me a favor, when I'm honest, to look after them. And I'm sure they will. They will. But please look after yourself. I, um... Well, I'm trying. But, um... And you're doing better than what many people, well, think. Maybe. Maybe. A lot, of, a lot of the guards probably would have thought that you'd run off like a bitch. Run back home. Thought you about know. it. But you didn't, did you? You stayed. That's better than what other people can say. Yeah, that's true, I suppose. I still think yours is more impressive, though. Going through hell and back and... 
Still walking. I'm only walking because I want to. And because I feel like I need to. Constantly. I'm... A mess. Mentally. <laughs> As... This morning... I didn't even realise I was bleeding out. I was too busy healing everybody else. I collapsed right next to Bing and I don't think Bing had to... I remember hearing like once in a while just the calls of medics and all that but... How um... How much pain are you in right now? I'm in a bit, but it's stuff I can't handle. It's mainly from the wounds from, well, him. Can I, um, uh, can I be selfish for a moment? No. Oh. I know I wasn't necessarily as close to you as some of the others, especially not being in Flora, but... You were still one of my first friends. Then you'll still always be a friend to me. <laughs> Regardless of how close we are. You're on the same level as Flora and Bing. <laughs> Took so the time think about me and to be worried about me. <laughs> that counts for something. I don't know, it feels like I skipped a few steps to get to their level, but... Nah. People do it in their own ways and... They do it in their own ways and in their own time. Some do it faster than others. That's... Otto only got a card because he he was dating Flora, so <laughs> You gave him you gave him a free bus pass, is that it then? <laughs> I gave him a free bus pass and, and now we just constantly tease each other, so ah, I see. That's like gaining a sibling in law, isn't it then? Pretty much, yeah. Laura's like a sister to me basically. We both came from the same academy. We were roommates there. The fact that I'm able to stand here and look towards the door that both me and Flora live, still live together in. <laughs> you still gotta sleep with her tonight, don't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> if I don't care if Otto's in there, I'm still crawling into the bed. <laughs> I doubt Flora will care. <laughs> they can miss out on a couple of weeks of snoo snooing for, you know, some time with their best friend. <laughs> so I'm sure they won't mind. I'm I am sure that they will be just fine with that. I don't know. <laughs> I'd I'd hope they wouldn't be, they would be fine with it, you know, cuz whether it's ha whether they want it or not, it's happening. So, you know, it's just Oh yeah, <laughs> it's happening. <laughs> it, it, yeah. Whether I also want it or not. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> I, uh, well, I... I'm glad to see you alive. That's about all I can really say at this point. Hey, I'm glad you're alive as well. Um... You know, I'm too scared to die, so. We're all allowed to be fearful of death. I'm terrified of it. Mm. But I'm face first and thinking I'm going to be perfectly fine when most of the time I'm not. It's just me being stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Fair enough, I suppose. But I've, uh, mm. I think I've bothered you enough then. So, I'll, uh... I'll leave you be, so you can go find whoever else you need to go to and, you know, finish up. I think that's it. I think I'm just going to go to bed. 
and do all of this again tomorrow. Gather my stuff and make sure Nishka's ready. Get the supplies that we need and get going. I'll um I'll give you a few things from the farm, just some fresh veggies for you to take with. So you've got something on the road. You don't have to. That's uh, not a big deal. I managed to save some before the siege. No, don't give them to me. Preferably, what I want you to do with those is to make a good meal for everybody in town. One that they'll enjoy. Help get Miss Mew to help you. Okay. Make sure the town's fed. We can deal with it us we can deal with our own stuff ourselves, don't worry. Focus on yourselves. Make sure you're not gonna do anything stupid, alright? Make sure other people don't do anything stupid, okay? Oh well I'm Someone's <sighs> gotta be the sensible one here. <laughs> well, you know how I am. I'm not exactly the smartest human alive, so but I'll make do. And no, are you the dumbest. I'll do as you asked, don't worry. Of course. Thank you. Have a good night, Mel. Have a good night, Eddie. <laughs> I'll think about it. What? Do you want me to call you Ed? <laughs> I, I have... Ed boy! <laughs> oh, don't, don't start with that. What's wrong, Ed boy? <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh, no. I'll just uh, sneak through the back paddy here and make my way. Oh. Make my way over here. Floating trees, that's fantastic. Uh. Uh. Leah has a whole ass gun. Um, she that hit is, it away where she That is nine barrels. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> I got this. I oh, got out to what the, the wrecks because I was just swimming and I was like, let's see if there's any like dead things still floating around in here. And then the they boat? were like, oh, you know. Oh, Lucas, you should check our Yeah, chat. it was on the boat. This thing was on the. It was in a barrel that was floating near the boat, Can and there was like it? a dead guy floating. Hiya! Yeah. No. <laughs> Thank that you. That was good. <laughs> check our chat. You should check our chat. I will. Right, cool. Very good. I liked it. Yeah, Locus is the pose for the dead body. Oh damn! Look, I, 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 make, I make my cowboy character. I meet Tali. No. I'm like, yo, give me. <laughs> it doesn't really. Hey, 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 is this a human form of Phoenix? No, this is Edmund. Yes. 
No, he's aware. He's aware, Lizard. I'm aware. <laughs> Fucking no! I genuinely thought that was the case. No, 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 no. Bruh. This is this is this is Edmund. This is a whole other character. And just regular regular human human dude. See, it has E in the name, same with Phoenix instead of Edmund. The, where is the conclusion of that? Where where are you drawing this from? Like they both Phoenix. Had... Exactly. What disconnected? Oh, my hips, my hips disconnected. My shit's dying. Ah, uh, damn! I knew that. I was gonna get a hold of you. Yeah, Asher took him. Marked, and that's it. Uh, that's I out of character. I, 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 I technically know about your illness now. That's crazy. You know about. Wait, what do you mean? I technically know about your ogre illness now. My illness? What illness? You know what I'm talking about, Chunk. Oh, wait, who, wait, did someone say something to you? Oh, no, that was me on the bed that said something, yeah. Kinda no. No, I didn't hear anything you said to me about that. Oh, what? You're just complaining like a little baby. What, what, what the fuck Bing happened? Bing told me about it. Wait, Bing told him? B I told- I, yeah, he told me about his ogre- uh, ogre disease. Oh because shit! he had a fucking hole in his chest, I look, and I looked at his lungs with black spots on it, I'm like, what the fuck? <laughs> what the That's fuck? Not good. <laughs> Wait, Bing has it? Oh shit! He's always had it. What? Remember? But it's not like it's not it's not degradating right now. Oh, he's not at there. He's yeah. Okay. Oh shit, that's not good. What is this guy's story? Um. Well, what, he, he, what does well, he do? <laughs> so originally, this was the first character that I played when I came to this RP. He's just a regular human. Um. He came from. Ah. He came from the the western regions of Aaron. He was along a lot of the coastal towns and stuff. His family were farmers. I'm explaining- I'm explaining the Edmund lore. His family were a bunch of farmers, he helped oh, out on the farms and such. We're connected, the, these two characters are connected. Um, ah. and he- they- they traveled around for a little while until they actually- until they actually did go to Bardist. Edmund doesn't remember that they were in Bardist. He doesn't remember the town's name, but he remembers that they were in a town for a little while. He got night training, and then he got- they got sent to Leafside very soon after. They didn't- they didn't spend a whole lot of time there. Um, because they were like, fuck, Leafside needs guards, here, just take a couple of the fucking rookies, have fun. And since then, he's been kind of staying at Leafside for for the while. And they, they did their job as guards, they did things around the town and helped out. They did, they did get involved with the elk stuff a little bit. I was there for when Snowball got captured and stuff. Um, but, uh... As of recently, he he was he was a guard for the town. He left because he views himself as an incompetent knight and a guard in that in that manner. So he doesn't he doesn't he doesn't think he's good enough to be a guard in the town, and he failed a lot of people. So he left. He decided to be a farmer uh, for the town instead. So he's he's been off doing farming stuff. He hasn't really been around a whole lot. It's mostly just been me playing as Phoenix. So. Not it, as he's also been slowly developing lightning powers, but he has no idea why. <laughs> and it's it's kind of lightning farm. Yeah, it's it's weird. It's weird because like it happened. It happened once when I was training with someone a while ago, and it happened again while me and uh, while me and Eva were were sparring. And while me and Eva were sparring, sparring, uh, I also I also got I also got this from her. Oh. Yep. So I got I got sliced up pretty bad, and that was kind of like the last straw for him. He's like, I can't, he's like, I can't fucking do this. It's not worth my time. I'm just gonna get myself killed. I'm gonna get in your guys's <laughs> way. So I'm getting the fuck out of here. And now he's farming. Wow. He also looks very intimidating in this lighting. <laughs> Does he have the lighting? The lighting issues. <laughs> I was explaining uh, to Steven the Edmund the Edmund lore TM. Mm, mm -hmm. TM. I, I will actually need to talk to you sometime, Locust, about some oh. clar like uh, clarification okay. regarding that stuff. Yeah, that's fine. Because I'm gonna be um, working with Coyote about some lore stuff regarding Chris's time in Burgess when we were there. Oh shit! Okay. So. Yeah. Ooh. So, I'll probably ask <laughs> sometimes. <laughs> Yippee! 
Yeah, I don't I don't know what I'm going to do for Edmund now though, to be honest, because I planned on keeping him around for a little bit longer, um, because I was gonna bounce off of Oracle a lot with Melody, but since Oracle is retiring Melody and a lot of other people are leaving, it's like, well, what the fuck do I do with him now? So mm -hmm. Well during like the whole tail. month. <laughs> bigger pony <tail>. uh, <laughs> <laughs> During the whole month, like time skip though, Chris is probably gonna spend most of her time in recovery, helping out uh, the farm. Sweet. Uh, like how I did last time. That's fine. Cause she's not gonna be able to do guard Bye -bye. stuff anymore, cause both her legs are fucked. So. Understandable. She'll be able to help a little bit with farm stuff. That's, that'd, that'd be good. That'd be nice. Mhm. Yeah. You have, yeah, you have, um, you have a nice face, ma'am. <laughs> well, you're looking. <laughs> uh huh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. You, 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 yeah. A nice face. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a nice. It's a, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, fingers are fucked yeah, up. Yeah. Do I get a nice, do I get a nice face? <laughs> uh -huh. It 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 it's it's a, it's a really nice face. Yeah. Yeah, really nice space, right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. For, fucking for <laughs> real. <laughs> I heard that. I fucking heard that. <laughs> it's just a soundboard. I'm not actually taking pictures. Mm, uh -huh. <laughs> I can prove it. <laughs> I'm not gonna take pictures. <laughs> I, I am, I am, I am the fucking corn-fed man from Ohio that you've been hearing about. That's that's basically who Edmund is. <laughs> He's just he's just a he's just a stocky human. That's pretty much it. This is just Phoenix from the past. No, so that's not. <laughs> <laughs> humans are normal. Two totally You don't you don't understand, Steve. These are two totally different characters. They're totally totally different right, characters. Right. No, they aren't, so Steven. You're not right, getting it. So no. <laughs> <laughs> is this gonna be one of those, you know, I'm not saying that Phoenix is Edmund, but I've never seen them in the same room together <laughs> situations. Exactly. <laughs> Fuck, I hate it. Oh my god. That's perfect. Oh, I gotta stop my I gotta stop my recording. Write that Whoops. down for a, for a next time I'm drunk in character. You I'm better better fucking not.